we're here. Uh, something, something across these new frontiers. I'm here, reaching far. Yeah, it's reaching far. Across reaching these far. new Fuck. frontiers. So yeah. You're, you're such a fake frontiers fan. You don't even know the. I'm layers. sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, so yeah, the the game's out. It's been like three weeks since it came out. And it, it, uh, mm -hmm. we, we, we had, we need some time to compute what we played. Yeah. Yeah, not, not, that's, not even, that's not even a negative thing, it's just, there, there is a lot, there's a lot to this game. <laughs> uh, so, I, I guess, uh, right off the bat, let, let's get, uh, 1 to 10, what do we think of the game, going in order of alphabetically? So, you- okay, we have to skip Ash, because- oh, Okay, yeah, so, <laughs> make this clear. I played the game, uh, Zeal played the game, uh, uh tra Trashy played the game in August, but not, uh, Ash. She, she just here to shit around, I guess. So, next up would be August. What- what- what do you think of the game? Good, seven? Good. Like August. six? Six? Like seven or something? I'm still kind of confused. Seven point too high. Hey, hey, they, they can think it's a seven. I, that's not too like bad. Um, am I next? I, I will. Oh, I can climb this. I didn't know that. My general opinion is that I enjoyed. I, I, I enjoyed it. I would have some gripes with it. I like the side missions. The, the some of the cyberspace levels trying me kind of made me fucking angry. And also, I have some I have some issues with like the character stuff, but I mostly enjoyed it. Again, and I'll, oh yeah, I forgot about one thing. Fucking, I don't like the third island or the fourth island. Hey, so, me too. I I I, I am okay with the fourth island. And uh, <laughs> the, I didn't, I didn't, uh, the fourth island's my least favorite part of the game. I'll just tell you that. Okay, we'll we'll, we'll get there. Um, am I next? Wait, what's what's who else is here? I, I already forgot. <laughs> right. Oh, wait, oh, yeah. No, no, Trash. I'm... I'm next, because my name starts with a D. Oops, I... I don't mind to fight you right now. I think... This game is a... 5 out of 10. I... Uh, there. It's... How, how would I describe this game? It's like... It's, it's more... For an open world game, it's more linear than I thought it would be. It, it's, well, I guess going by the trailers, it's just as linear as I thought it'd be. But I didn't, like, even though it's extremely easy, and most of them, where you, you just pretty much just hold forward, like, you know, you know, you just go to all these, hold forward, and then you win. I, I still, like, mm, it, it's, 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 it's always what I see for forces, where, like, it's so simple, the gameplay, that it can't really be bad. Though, Forces had, like, Classic Sonic, which was actually bad. And th this game has, you know, its, its own Classic Sonic moments. So, like, I, I think everything just equals out to a middle. I Surprisingly, I didn't hate Cyberspace that much. I, I actually, um... Like, during the trailers, it was my least favorite part, but... It it actually might be my the part I forgive the most in this game. N not not in terms of like yeah. originality, the this like stealing from other levels kind of still annoys me, but I think like just purely gameplay wise, I think it holds up the most. And combat, uh well, I will get there. <laughs> I'll get there. Alright, so next up is Tyler Trashy. I don't know what you would go by anymore. Okay, so uh I personally I'd give this game like a three and a half. Whoa. I don't like this game. Yeah, I'll, I'll say it. F like, fundamentally, I do not enjoy the majority of this gameplay. I, I do like how like, it feels like a fever dream sometimes. <laughs> that's but generally, for me, it, it feels like filler for a game that's not there, which I do not have, know how to explain that any better. I, I think I get where you're coming from with that. I, I will agree. I, I think cyberspace is the best part. I th I thought that those were okay. Man, that, like, that is whole, not what I. <laughs> I did not think we would island, come home with that. The whole island. I do not like the islands. The island parts. 
like at all. And yeah, that's my general thoughts. All right, Zealous or Ray, which, whichever path yeah. you choose. <laughs> whichever. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, for a rating, I'd probably give it like. Oh. What? Five, maybe six. What's like, happening? Oh no. <laughs> oh, the, All right, it's dropped to a four. Okay, well. <laughs> Solid five now. The blood okay, moon um, rises again. <laughs> yeah, no, it's um, blood time. Okay, I, I'm, I'm back. Sorry, I was getting a drink. Oh, hey. Wow, rude. Yeah, I'd say like a five, maybe a six. Because like, uh, there's definitely parts that I enjoyed. There are a lot of interesting, at least, concepts. But it's like, yeah, I feel I'd like there's so. like a lot of... Yeah, there's like a lot of room that I feel it could have done better. I don't know, it's kind of hard to quantify this game. Yes, like, like as I said, it, this game is very overwhelming with, with what's, what's on it. Fuck. Uh, I, I, I... I hate this, um, the, the random just... Oh yeah, this is so what, annoying. And, and I always called. have way too many big coins to really care about it. <laughs> like, I, I actually avoid it, like, every time. Yeah, like, I literally do not- after, like, maybe the first time it happened, I just stopped caring. Yeah, and, like, let me grab him right now- no, fuck. No, 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 I don't want you, I don't want you, I don't want you. Like, grab him right now. Look at how long it takes for the- <laughs> the thing to go. I just wish there was a way to, like, cancel this manually. Yeah. So to wait for it. Cause, like, I- I remember- I was in the middle of like a box in like the sand area, and then it just started. Look at how long that was! And you're getting collected constantly, because look how many there are. I, I also really hate the fact that the cutscene plays every single time the Starfall approach, like the Starfall. The is. Star Bits for Mario like, Galaxy. Yeah, I, I just. Yeah. It, it just throws me off. Even though, like, even though you can skip it. It this cutscene plays every single time, and I fucking hate that. I I guess it's not frequent enough for me to care. It, it's just it, it it keeps getting in the way. Okay, it happens I, so it happens so often for me. It's insane. Okay, I forgot to add something onto mine. Okay. Okay, so in, in the last video, no, I, no, I said no, the no 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 no. I I said the fact that there is a skill tree kind of brought it down for me, but um, it like barely exists in this. Yeah. I. So yeah, I guess that wasn't as big of an issue as I thought. By it's just not being useful at all, pretty much. It, just get them like so I fast. Mean, I got two hundred big coins. You could argue the skill tree being non-existent is also an issue in itself. Well, it's an that's, issue for that's others, what maybe. I think. But, but for me, I'm happy because I hate skill trees. Well, Tyler Trashy irrationally hates uh like skill trees, so I guess it's a bonus for him. Yeah, I can see how that would be annoying for people who thought that was a cool thing added. Yeah. I, mean, I, I finished that skill tree, like, the second area. I I had it almost done by, like, the first I, area. Yeah, I yeah, same, same, same like, here. Full, full completion. I, uh, I do not like this game. Th thank you, Ashley. <laughs> it, yeah. I don't really know how else to put it. Yeah, I just, I don't like it. Well, you haven't played it though. It's it's your opinion doesn't I've matter. Seen, I've seen a good amount of it. I do not oh. like. It. Oh wait, another thing I'll add. I like the dancing scene. It made me no, laugh. No. <laughs> <laughs> I I, yeah. I want to talk about I, I, our experience in no, that cutscene because that that was life changing. Yeah, that's what made me realize this whole game is just a fever dream. <laughs> anyway, I let's mean, I like. like I like that they- I like the concept of, like, the fucking- of, like, more in-depth combat, but, like, it sucks in this game. Yeah, they- Honestly. they started oh, and- there you go. Ended yeah, right away. <laughs> you know, yeah, let, let's start at the beginning. Oh, what's- what's- what's, like, that move that you can just spam and win every fight with, oh, like, oh, the kick? we- we will get there. We oh. will get there. Yeah, he has to stretch it out for three hours. No, yeah, no, true. I want to talk about the level design first. We, we have to we have to beat the other people that talked about this game. Yeah, yeah. We, we have to do it longer than uh, Fidel's video. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's how you know we're more right. 
It all started when they changed the homing attack to a punch button. What? Well, it's both. Well, I uh, I guess we can start with that. The um, the controls. So the boost has now changed to the uh, right trigger. Uh, the right trigger. And surprisingly, that that still works pretty well. The only gripe yeah. I'd have with that is um, now I can't really quick step while I'm boosting. Yeah, I hate that. Like, well, the thing is, I, I don't. I just don't need the quick step in this game. I, I like, I never need okay, it. Yeah, that so. is. Yeah, the that is true, but the, I never used the quick step at all. Yeah, honestly. Yeah. If like I want, I... if I, Go if ahead. I want to, if I want to say the controls for this game, when I first played it, I was honestly like, "Oh, fucking you! What the fuck is this?" And then when I, and then I got used to the controls. I'm like. Okay, you know, this isn't, this isn't, I wouldn't say this is my preferred way of playing, but like, I guess I can live with this. But what I kind of find stupid is that, I, th I think in only the PC version you can change your controls, because I played the PS5 really? version, Oh. and you can't change, you can't change the controls in the PS5 version. So yeah, that, I remember, honestly, that yeah. really annoyed me. Yeah, I remember looking, like, just kind of through the settings. There is no, there's not even like a control scheme, it's just... You're just locked with how it is by the default. Yeah, um, yeah, you, you can't just, you can't change, like, action style or speed style, which, like, I mean, I remember people said, like, the speed style, I think, was the better one, and I think that was the one I chose. I do not remember. That was the most forgettable part of the entire oh, game, yeah, to I be don't... honest. What, what, oh, what I was that? Forgot about that? I, I chose Wait, speed I... because I, I don't like it being slow, but what, what I... does that do? I... I don't know, but I but like apparently it plays worse if you do action style, which nice. I imagine so. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, I, I completely oh, no. forgot about that. I, I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, but like when you're not at like max ring, Sonic feels like way too slow. Like when you're not boosting. I think yeah, that's yeah. the point. So you upgrade your uh, speed set. Uh, uh, your I, speed okay, set. Your, your speed stat doesn't really affect, like, just general speed. It just affects your boost and your drop Yeah, it's dash. just the boost. It doesn't feel like it affects, like, regular... Yeah, no, uh, no, like, like run, run without boosting. It felt no, pretty no. much... Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, good thing I have a way to go faster, then. I, I don't see yeah, the problem with that. Yeah. No, yeah. It's not, it's it's just, not a huge like, problem to me. It's not like Lost World, where you barely go faster by holding the button. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I love Lost World. Okay, but he turns into a figure eight, though. That's cool, right? That's a reference. Yeah, reference, reference. Oh, uh, anyway, um, so in terms can of we, controls, can we, can we talk about that, please? I actually don't want to talk about the writing that much in this because I don't want I don't want this to make any I don't want this to be any longer. But we we, we can okay. touch on some parts. Uh, I think Zavok would love it here. Z Zav, that, no, it's not the line. It, it's Zav, I don't know. I actually don't remember, but it, it, it's it's like Zavok would feel right at home here. Yeah, right? Zavok. That, no, <laughs> he's yeah, in the that's middle of like is. this field. The, I, what's walk. what's the, the correlation? No, I think it was the volcano one, maybe. I it, don't remember like, though. The, the dialogue in this game is like fucking Family Guy cutaway guy. <laughs> it's just like that one time <laughs> I was in Mystic Ruins. Yeah, Lois. Oh my God! I when that when I first. When, I, when the Mystic Ruins line, I was just like, it, I, <laughs> I think my brain stopped working for a few seconds when I first heard it. Like, oh my gosh, this waterfall is just like the Mystic. Bro, shut it's, up! It's just a waterfall. <laughs> it's just a waterfall. Man's has never seen a waterfall other than the Mystic Ruins. Okay. Wow, this grass is green. Reminds me of Green Hill. Uh, no way. No, no, no. He and said the, that you this know forest is green. It's, it's just like Green Forest. Oh, I can't. I, I can't wait to talk about Green Hill in this game. And you know what they say, Green Hill's looking a lot more like Sandhill like right about now. Okay. Anyway, back to controls because that's <laughs> where we started with. I don't understand why everyone hates controls this game. I I thought the uh, homing attack to um to I I'm using PS4 controller right now, so map to square. I th I think that was actually a good idea because now I don't get cucked out of my double jumps. Mm. And, uh, yeah, I think that's it. Um, I don't like how the, uh, dodge is mapped to the bumpers, because, um, 
I don't actually get to control where I dodge. I only have two directions. You know, usually you'd want to dodge like backwards. Oh, I so. Uh, yeah. I, I, just, 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 just give Sonic a Dark Souls roll there. Yeah. Uh. Well, the dodge is useless anyway because you have the strongest oh, yeah. defensive move. We'll get oh, there. Yeah, just float there. Just float. I, 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 no, I genuinely can't believe you can just stall in. Yeah, yeah, you, you can just. I, oh, I, okay, so. They decided to add a parry move, except the parry move is constant. Y you can just hold it down until it attacks. So, like, there you're kind of invincible. <laughs> there is nothing stopping you from holding it yep. like, forever. It's like every Super Sonic fight is basically piss easy, because you can just... I guess we'll get there, but, you know, like, you kind of can't be hit anymore, because you can just parry it. Without like ever needing to time it, also I can just infant stall in the air here. <laughs> Actually, another thing about the parry, some like you know, like a jump rope challenge you can do. Yeah, you can just, you just parry say... in the you can just you can just parry in the air, win. And yeah. I found this out by one of my friends playing the game, and I I noticed that I was like, what the fuck? So, cause like I knew you could like Sonic Boom onto the jump rope thing. Yeah, that's all I did. I didn't know you could parry. I didn't know you could parry. Th this just be in the air. This can't be intentional though. Like this has to be a mistake. There's no way they just let this happen. No, they shipped it this way. This is the intended way to play. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 Tyler, Tyler, say what they said about the launch of the game. Oh, <laughs> oh I, I already oh. said it technically, but uh... I forgot what he said. Hold on, let me find uh, the tweet. Let me find the they, tweet. They, they, essentially, they essentially said they're treating it as like a global play test, right? Whatever. Yeah, global play test. Yeah, That's after everyone saying. paid their he, money. He, 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 said yeah. the game, he said the game has a long way to go, and it's in, they're treating it as an open play test. What the fuck? You had five years! I can't wait for all the DLC as well. I, I, well, who said Izuka? I, I don't remember where oh, I saw it. Because Isuka uh, said the open world, open uh, zone bullshit, so... Oh, that. Oh. He, 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 oh, he only says crap, like... It's the director who said that, whoever that is. Okay, well, it, they always say weird things, so I... I... Oh, Kishimoto, however you Yeah, I just wouldn't listen to them. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah. Well, oh yeah, of course! Of course! We have... Everyone loves the drop dash! It doesn't even carry your speed. I know, there is literally no use to this. If why it, would you add really a spin dash type move if I have a fast button? Like, wh what's the point? I just used it for shits and giggles. Yeah. And, and you can't even, like, jump with it? You, you lose your momentum. Yeah, the, the momentum I, in the game feels so bizarre. I, like, I noticed that when you use the drop dash, sometimes you can't just move, like, left to right when you use it, so it feels kind of awkward. Oh, yeah, it's true. Why would it... Why would you use this over the the boost like at all? Like it's so obvious. It's only here because it it's from good game. Uh, real quick, can you give yourself infinite boost real quick? Just oh, just, okay. Let, let's talk about the psi loop. So you know, pr pretty simple stuff. You know, you you, you go around like a shielded enemy, or a thing you need to interact oh, with. Boy. You you just go around it. Do it. The other mechanic it does okay. is. I get rings, Wahoo. but I can just do it again get more rings, I can do it again get more rings, I can do it again, I can do it again, I can do it again, 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 and, and I even get, I get 10 oh, yeah, rings, I get, wait, I, I get experience so, points, so yeah, it, it's basically pointless to upgrade, I, I, I get upgrade fruits, get. seeds, whatever they call yeah, it, you, you, you can just farm, yeah, you, you can theoretically do this, and it's probably faster than normal progression. Uh, let me... Did, did you so, yeah, do in your playthrough? Uh, a little bit. Okay. Yeah, damage doesn't mean anything anymore. I oh, okay. I loop percent, I guess? Yeah, maybe, that's just probably a thing. So let me get hit here. Oh no, you're losing your rings, what are you gonna do? So this is my normal boost speed. And so it's supposed to be like a thing where, uh, if you survive long enough and get enough rings, you can get the super boost. Thing is, I can just grind rings like this and instantly get the super boost. See, I do yeah, this little movie Sonic animation. 
Yeah, it's pretty fast. Nice. Every single time. Yeah, and and I move very fast, but yeah, no, and also when I do a infinite logo, I get infinite boost for a short amount of time. So it's no, just, not a short; it's decently long. I I don't it's remember. Like a few minutes. So basically, oh. from this one move, you can, you you can get all this just for free, even though it's they clearly intended for that to be like a reward for being good at video games. Honestly, I just saw it as more of a traverse, a better traversal mechanic because honestly, using the normal fucking boost, like, why would you use the normal boost when you could just like side loop, side loop a hundred times and then bam, you just get the, you just get the max boost or whatever it's called. I, I don't even know what it's called. I don't know. Well, I also think it's supposed to be like a reward thing because, all right, so you see in the bottom left there, I can level up shit. So I can level up. Uh, well, I, I get the seeds for attack and defense. And I get Coco to um, either upgrade my rings or my speed. Here's the thing, right? If I don't get any ring, if I don't get any ring upgrades, I I will get super. Like I'll get Movie Sonic like even faster. So why would I want more rings? You know, like why would I want max rings if if I can bring my max rings lower, then I can get this faster. And also, Pretty like achievement. It, it, uh, it doesn't matter that you have like less health because health doesn't mean anything anymore because you can just silence. Yeah, you, you can just get it back instantly. Yeah. I was gonna say for the supersonic bosses, but I think you just get like a bunch of rings for the supersonic bosses anyway, no, and you, then you'll survive, and you'll have like a four minute time limit, you, and you're, uh, that's plenty of time to get the boss. Honestly, that's plenty of time to kill the boss. Your your, your, your base I, ring count for hundred is more than enough for the supersonic fights. It's it's completely oh, yeah, fine. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But oh wait, also, didn't you say that um, the movie Sonic thing, the super boost, doesn't like... Isn't it the same as like, max speed? Yeah, yeah, so... No, yeah, it is, yeah. So, uh... So, like, so it's kind of pointless, okay, no. it's kind of pointless to upgrade both of them at that point. When you can just instantly get your super boost. But then if you have max speed, you don't need to get to the super boost. Okay, okay so the super boost thing, it does not increase when you level up your speed, right? Mm -hmm. So, but... It, when you get max speed, your default boost yeah, becomes just, a super yeah. boost. Meaning, basi you basically have max level boost all the time if you do the Silub trick. So, like, mm -hmm. both rings and speed are useless. You, you just don't need to talk to that Elder Coco at all to upgrade your shit. Can I, can I comment on that Elder Coco for one second? Yeah. I find it really dumb that the, that the, there's not like a sort of like thing you have to do with like leveling up where you can just say oh I want to level up to 99 not 99 because yeah. I have all these cocos. Oh my to, gosh, yeah. yeah. It made it so unironically that was the hardest part of completion. <laughs> you just had to sit there for 20 minutes yeah. just just choosing the upgrades you want and and I'm like oh my god yeah, I have to I remember, put on something yeah. in the background I have right something now. to put on the background and, and just to distract myself from just it killing takes my so long just to upgrade your shit yeah uh, like, like I wish there was like a like attack and defense thing it's literally automatic like you just give the you just give the other cold cold like your seeds and then automatically you have one why can't it be look, like, why, why can't it not be like that with the other Elder Hulk Coco and when you're collecting Cocos? I don't get it. I wish it was like at the very least like um, like a point attribution type menu. But no, you have to sit through an animation every single time you want to go up one number. All right, so this guy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. this guy. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. So I I I, uh, I trade Cocos. I get to increase speed or raise ring capacity. I choose the speed, okay, I get one level. But wait, I have Marcoco, so I I have to talk to him again and then increase it again, go through the cutscene and it's just like what Jesus man. Why can't you just do it all at once? Yeah, I, I remember like after I got like um after I got out of the session from like the fishing, I went from level like fifty something to like maximum. That took so long just because of the animation, having to play every time. Yeah, look the same. It's big. Big, big breaks the entire game. I love oh, Big. Oh, yeah. He's so, he's so stupid. B big. 
<laughs> Once again, ruins, ruins another game. <laughs> in a good way, potentially. I want him to in, ruin in some, funny I want him to ruin in me. In a funny way. <laughs> anyway, uh, instead of the instead sly of, loop. Instead of yeah. Instead of big, you know, being kind of a well, I guess I I didn't really mind big in adventure, but you know what I'm gonna say like, like this. Instead of big emotionally damaging people, he he, he just. He just breaks the entire game for you. <laughs> yeah, you know it's it's uh he he's trying to fix things by helping people instead of hurting them. Uh, you know, character it, it, development. Look, it's not easy for him. Every Sonic fan wants to fuck him. Yeah, I, would IGN lie? I don't think so. Yeah. <laughs> Have you guys seen that video where like <laughs> that one guy brought up how everyone's shitting on them for that video from five years ago? But, like, they genuinely seem mad that people keep making fun of it. Okay, but yeah, it's funny that... I... What, what, they're mad that people are making fun of them for saying people want to fuck Big the No, cat? just the general, like, Sonic was never good video. Uh... Because that, that yeah. came from it. Yeah, I know, oh, but... and... Alright, that's a good segue to talk about the tricks. <laughs> uh, so, that every did. now and then, this game just launches you. And, and you're stuck going in that direction, because, uh... It wants you to do tricks. I, I just said oh, it right that's now. That's only like, after. That's only after you unlock it, though. Yeah, like that. So like, you have but, to jump out of yeah. it to escape from it. But at that point, you're sent so far that you're you might as well be dead. Are, are we gonna yes. talk about the uh, bugs in this game? Maybe I. I don't think there's any, any any too major. I, I, I like. Power. I just. I just want that one clip. Go on, fight that tower. No. You know the clip. Ocean clip. I, I think Oh, that yeah. Be I, I've video. never seen anyone run into that except for me. Oh my god, again. Still, I, I think it needs to be in here. Oh, yeah. There's, like, times where I just fall fall off the map constantly, oh, and I can't god. tell if it's my fault. It's, it's probably fucking my fault. Oh, my well, god. I guess it's not a problem because you don't really get penalized for it. Tower. Yeah, but it's just annoying. It's just kind of annoying. The, it's just like the way the game flings you around everywhere, and yep, yeah, there you go. <laughs> uh, oh wow, that was just sudden stop. Yeah, yeah. I say, how this game like detects was... like uh, ramps or whatever is so bad that I yeah, it's just constant. It's so in the way. I will, I will say I didn't really mind the trick system. It's just that sometimes it just got. It just sometimes it's really annoying that it gets gets me killed sometimes because you can't move in any direction without jumping. Yeah, it, it's the loss of control is just really annoying. I, yeah, I don't know why it feels kind of, it, it feels disorienting. I don't know why it, it doesn't activate just from like springs or whatever or like mm. the ac actual ramps like uh like the, these things. Yeah, I I I, I will say running I, I think running around like some of the environments I I will say I kind of felt that I kind of thought that was fun and then I got to Chaos Island and uh, uh I'll get the Chaos Island <laughs> right there. I'll get the Chaos Island. I, I thought I was gonna really like that one, and then I didn't. Yeah, I, I didn't like it. Um, I, I still do find it fun to run around shit. Yeah, sure. Like I'm doing right now. Yeah. Right now, yeah. Let, let's talk about how the game begins. In a ve very oh, yeah. strong start. I... And I, I find it really funny. Like, it says, like, a new exper experience Sonic like never before at Green Hill Zone. <laughs> I, I know, I know the game's trying to advertise the open zone world stuff, but like, it's just funny to me. Yeah, this, this is the starting level in, just... in Frontiers. This, this is the first thing you play. So like, remember oh, Breath yeah, of the Wild? A... Like the second you leave your chamber, you see the whole world. Like you're on a cliff, you see the whole world in front of you. This game, like this game, starts with the linear Green, green Hill level. That's stolen oh, from Unleashed. <laughs> Are we talking does... about cyberspace now? Yes. Please. Oh boy, please. I love. I need to. I love the I... four themes, all four of them. Yep. I I want to say, after I after I'm 100 percent in the game, I went back into the cyberspace levels again, some of the and I will say, I actually enjoyed some of them. I actually enjoyed some of them. And then there's some of them that I just want to rip my hair out, like that one that stole like a unleashed rooftop run bonus level. I fucking hated that level so much. It, it felt 
I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. I just really hated that level. And also, I don't mm. like the level. That's like the 2D rails one, which. Oh, I didn't mind that I, one. I talk about the rails. Um, yeah, the rail physics actually, are kind of weird, yeah. So, I um, will say, in 3D, they're fine, but in 2D, they're fucking weird as hell. So, uh, like, so about. Oh, go on. Yeah. And I will. Like, I did enjoy some of the 2D cyberspace levels, oddly enough. I think I'm probably one of the only people who will say that, but some of them got on my nerves. Like, again, that one's Sky Sanctuary cyberspace level that I, I forgot like what the number was was that, but it was like a 2D section, and it had like the one section where you had to go into the to, to the Sonic Unleashed uh, shoot shooty things, and then and then it, and then also there's like a bunch of balloons you have to homing attack and oh, I, was it the one with like the the shooty things and like you have to navigate like a spikes for one of the parts. Yes, yes, it was yes, that one. I, I it was that, that yeah. one. It was that one. I really do not like that one. Like when I was trying to one hundred percent the game, I thought Ooh. like it might be like it might be a little bit on me because I thought the, t the time would be a lot more stricter. But I was trying to get like a I was trying to get an S rank on that and I wanted to tear my hair out. So it's probably, I guess it's kind of my fault because I didn't check the time, which is piss easy, but I st still, I really did not like it. So, uh, so when um, you get out of cyberspace, is so like, you, you go there to get keys to unlock Chaos Emeralds, and you have to collect seven for each island. So you get one for reaching the goal, very difficult. Reaching S rank time, which I actually is a really good, I think is a really good idea. Like, a fundamental issue I have with a lot of Modern Sonic is like, why should I boost through this? Like, why should I make my? Why should I make it harder for me to dodge obstacles? Like, like sh shouldn't it be better if I take it slower? You haven't, you haven't justified me going faster. But in this, you actually you get reward for going faster by getting an S rank time, getting an S rank time. So, I, I I think that's a big improvement in Modern Sonic, even though it's a minor part of the game. Then you got uh, get get a certain amount of rings, which. I guess depending on the stage, it's harder or easier. There's only one where I, ha well, I had to like go out I, of my way to get rings. I think they adjust it for the levels anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some of yeah. them, are, yeah. And some of them are like eighty. Some of them are like fifty. The red star rings are kind of embarrassing. Like there, there's tons where it's actually hard to not get. Like they're they're so like in right in front of you that overall these are really easy. Like. So a lot of times I get all four at once, just like first try, with one exception. But we're we'll talk about it later. Yeah, I will say the only one that I found the red star rings like a little bit kind of tedious was the was one of the city like one of it's actually one of the levels I actually kind of liked like the city level with like the open, I guess the more open alternate paths and all that. I don't know, I forgot what level they took that from. Or if it's an original level, because I think there are some original level there's signs a, in there. There's a few. Like there's a few, yeah. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, I just want to make sure. But I think that was one of the original ones, but don't quote me on that. But but I, I will say I like that one, but I it, I did find it a little bit tough because I thought you had to go do like the shortcut in order to get it. And then it was not on the shortcut, it was in another area I didn't check. So, yeah. That, yeah, it got me once. Good job, game. It's so, not that big of a deal. Like, I think it's I think it's better for it to kind of be a little quicker. So it's like an in and out sort of thing. So it doesn't really last long because I feel like the cyberspace levels are also a bit. They're trying. They're they're a bit arcadey. I mean, hey, when you beat the game, arcade quote unquote arcade mode are just the cyberspace levels. I I I, I guess just like. I wish they were harder because the stuff in the old world is so straightforward that like uh, the Cyrus Cy thing would would really benefit from being like like a real challenge. It, it, it's just uh, yeah, like anyone that. that's experienced with Modern Sonic can do them so easily. M yeah. Maybe with like a, yeah, maybe like yeah. one or two retries just to get the red rings, but other than that, it's mm -hmm. it's it really doesn't take anything out of you. About the cyberspace and like the level ripping, like, I, of, of course, I think it'd be better if they like made their own levels, of course, but like, if they're gonna rip old levels, I wish it would have been like 
at least like more obscure ones so then it could be like a game of trying to like remember which game it was from but most of them are like pretty obvious levels well i, j I, like, just, I, wish, I just wish they had like, like the I visuals of the originals yeah the like i want stuff. yeah like i want i want a shadow the hedgehog level on this in this game but, but, but like, like, like uh, green hill over yeah i over... want my Green Hill over Pumpkin Hill was like some 1984 shit, like, it was actually Green Hill this whole time. It was always Green Hill, it was never Pumpkin Hill. There's only four yeah, levels. That's, that is my- We're always that is, at war with, with East Asia. That is my headcanon from now on, they're trying to erase Pumpkin Hill from history. No, a, 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 yeah, every like, zone that isn't a uh, city or Green Hill or Chemical Plant or a Sky Sanctuary, it did not exist. It was always those yeah, four. But yeah, if they're gonna- so funny. If they're one of the, yeah. like yeah, if they're already if they're already ripping levels, I wish they weren't so obvious. Yeah, it was I think so the funny only ones that of... weren't. Um, I think the most deep cut they got was the unleashed was the unleashed bonus levels of like the rooftop and um, yeah the yeah dragon was it what what's it called dragon, dragon road or dragon, like I think it was not. I was about to say the Mario Kart 8 track name. It's I just drag to it. <laughs> Dragon Road. Dragon Road. I think it's Dragon Road, I think. Dragon but, Road, uh, I think, yeah. Please, um, please, I'm, someone. Well, Sonic, how do you remember someone, this? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Metal please Harbor, someone. I guess, was not too obvious, even though it was from an adventure game, but I it, did it was a bit more than that. Yeah, I, like, that's another thing about the cyberspace levels. I don't like how the theming is just those four. Those four. Yeah, like, if it's like if it's I, pulling from like Sonic's all of Sonic's memories supposedly and like mapping shit based off of that, why are there only four things? Yeah, like, it genuinely it to me it felt like it almost felt like they were making fun of people complaining about Green Hill because yeah. this game is so bad, so bad. It's like one of the worst with it because there's only those four themes. Like one fourth of the levels it, are Green Hill. And like, it's the city level. I, I think the city re level, I guess, is original, but like, it's it's the one that's used the least. I think it's yeah. it's basically it's like, the like a generations the uh, city levels like combined together. Yeah, the, the, I remember. Which, I mean, yeah. That isn't a, that isn't actually a bad idea, if I'm gonna be honest. Like an amalgamation, trying to make like an amalgamation of like different levels and kind of make something new oh, out of there, it. I don't there, think that's a terrible is, idea. I think that can one... work. There is one level that combined two old levels, like one of the snowboarding sections was taken from one level and the rest was like a different one. Oh, right. I, I brought this up in the uh, the trailer, like, uh, breakdowns. The background, like, w the backgrounds with like uh, all the different like level blobs like all floating around and like it's like super like uh, broken up and abstract and all that. And, but like the actual, th the actual like level you're playing is completely normal, it's not broken up at all. They could have done that, but like, even like like with different like levels, even like like combining a bunch of like random shit together in Sonic's memories. Yeah, like like yeah, stuff yeah, like, like that would be kind of cool. Imagine like imagine like, yeah, like, like Green Hill, Green Forest, and White Forest kind of just come trying to be combined together. Yeah, like, winter, you know, like even more contrasting, like uh, like Green Hill to fucking Eggman Land, like <laughs> yeah, that would be cool. <laughs> like with their oh, rich movie. God. Imagine there was a cyberspace level based on the entirety of Eggman Land. Oh my and god. He becomes so a werehog god. only for that one part. <laughs> oh, Just god. like you can only drift for one cyberspace uh, level. I, I can't believe uh, it. Wait, hold on. Oh, yeah. Why? You know what? I'm, I'm actually kind of glad that didn't return because honestly, I didn't like the drifting. It was colors yeah. drifting, and I uh -oh. don't like colors drifting, so there you go. I, I, I like the Generations one. That that level generation that, drifting was good, yeah. But I like that, generation that, drifting was amazing. Yeah, it, I liked it. That level. I even like the animation. I like the animation that he does as yeah, well. Yeah, that, that, that's really good for this. I, but, uh, I'm I'm going to get murdered for this. So for defending it's, drifting. It's, it's, yeah, for defend no for de because apparently people don't do not like the generation drift. People just prefer really or at, at least they prefer the unleashed one. I don't know if it's like I I hated that I don't one. Know if so much. Uh, Eggman Land? No, like the the drifting level. Oh, uh, oh, the drifting level. Yeah, yeah that, I, that I also wasn't not... my favorite. It felt pretty bare. It, it, it felt pretty bare. So, it took me so long to finish that level. You know what? Like, the better strategy is to just to jump over the drifting part. <laughs> but yeah, I do it, not like unleashed drifting. Anyway, with uh, 
<laughs> hey, go ahead. I, I just wanted to, and I also just want to comment on one last thing about cyberspace. I, I kind of was not going in expecting to hate it because I kind of saw it as kind of like an, a separate arcadey thing, and I guess that made my opinion of it more positive, if anything. I guess, but there's still some parts that I just didn't like about it, like that one, that one rooftop run level that I really do not like. I, I, I hope that level burns. Well, I, like, the first impression for, for Cyberspace on me, which was that one, like, it it, it was not a good first impression, because it was Green Hill with the, like, the, with an Unleashed level put over it, and but more simplified and, like, uglier. So, like, that, like I, I was already ready to hate it. Like, as it went on, like, I, I don't know, it, it, I guess it was refreshing compared to the pretty repetitive gameplay of the overworld. I... I didn't... Some uh, some parts, the overworld gameplay did feel repetitive to me, but I didn't really feel that of the entirety of it, but I can understand why it feels repetitive. It did feel... Again, it did feel kind of repetitive at times to me when you do the same platforming section you already did, and the game just doesn't really tell you, I guess. So you're just running around in circles sometimes. Yeah, and anyway, now I've, I've been trying to stall staying around this area because next up in the natural progression, you, you just, you, you explore this little stuff. And now you fight enemies. Wahoo. All right, Holy all right so in most Sonic games, the gameplay is pretty, the combat's pretty simple. Homing attack. Homing attack. Only attack. Only attack. But in this... I, I guess I'll show in, with the uh, the boss fight up ahead. They advertised the shit out of the combat. Yeah. Because it is this experience Sonic like never before. Open zone. Level Ninja. In-depth combat. So now it's in-depth because oh I, I, I can hit it multiple times. <laughs> Oh, there's two. Uh, ignore there's the, all that cool shit I do. It, it's not. Oh, 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 oh. Let me just uh, let me, let me turn off. Have... Let, me, let me turn off the auto combo. <laughs> Wait, do you actually have? You have auto combo? <laughs> no, it's cause it's it's you. unlockable auto combo. No, I I get it, but like, <laughs> God, I can't trust you anymore. I'm sorry. I'll say, ignore this. I, I I got the save off of the internet. I I, I unlocked everything like second area. I I swear. Yeah, sure. I, I, okay, I want to say on the combat because I felt like the combat did have a did have some potential, but I think it's limited. That's that's yeah. just how I feel about it. The potential is just limited because some of the enemies, like I think late late in the game, the combat does kind of shine through, mostly with like the guardian fights, which we'll get there. But 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 I but. I feel like when you're just going up against regular enemies, it does, the combat does feel pretty simplistic. Except for like, in like the last island where there is some kind of thought you need to, you need to have in, or, in the fucking combat for the normal enemies. Although one of the enemies, you just fucking parry and then that's it, which I mean, that's like every single fight, but that's besides the point. But what I'm trying to say is, I think the combat had potential, but some too, but many of the fights just fell too short, except for like mm -hmm. the Titan fights or Titan fight, Guardian fights. I keep getting mixed up. Okay, so like for this boss specifically, you basically just mash like the attack, and then when it attacks, you have to do a little dodge, like it's automatic dodge move, that brings you behind it, and then you continue attacking. That's it. But the thing is. But like, okay, like, like dodging around, going behind it to attack it from that angle. That seems like an interesting yeah. mechanic, uh, but this is the yeah, only the boss that uses it. Yeah. Like, it's basically the only one that uses it, except for its then, uh, variants. And then they bring it back for, like, one enemy type. No, it's, it's only the ninja variants, right? I, I mean, you can you can do it with, like, the later level, like, uh, regular enemies, I think. Yeah. Why would you yeah. need it, though? Oh, yeah, I think in, Ch in Chaos Island, I think they they do have shields, but yeah. I don't think there's, like, but I don't think you dodge in order to do it. No, no, you just do the, side the shields are in all directions, though. You just do side loop on them. 
No, I, no, I mean like the like uh, the the red ones and like the white. I forget if the white ones have it too, but the red ones do have like the front shield where you would have to go dodge behind them. Yeah, and I remember there were variants of like I think tower that did have the shield thing, but even oh, then, they? yeah, yeah. But I think it doesn't really matter because even then you could just use the side loop on them, and. I found myself using the side loop way more often than I like to admit on the enemies because honestly, it just makes the fights a whole lot easier. Okay, what I'm trying to say here is just uh, like that it, one potentially like pretty cool mechanic yeah. that can add some death. It, it's just used once basically. Yeah, it, it's it's used way less than like. Why, why can't you just do that regularly? Why does it have to be specific enemy type for you to be able to do that? I don't know. And anyway, we get some more shit here, and all right. So, I guess we should talk about the level design. So, I I made fun of this in the trailer, like breakdown, but so much of this is just like, okay, that all I pressed there was square, and well, I've already gotten it, but I I, I got a uh, token from that, and if I just do this. Go forward, and I get a token. It's like... It's so simplistic, so much of the game. It's... What this basically is, is... A bunch of... I know I know this sounds harsh, but like... A bunch of AI-generated, like, forces levels... Placed on top of, like, this world. You know, it, it's... It's just... Extremely simplistic... Segments... That they... To get the shit, and they, you just do them over and over. Yeah, that, that's why I found the game pretty repetitive. Like, here, let me find another one. Let me go forward. Uh, we got... We got this guy. And I would've got a token there. That That's how simple it is. It's like, find a spring or a dash pad. Maybe jump like a few times and then you get a token. Yeah, and, and I would have got a token there. It's yeah, I it, it's like I assume this would have gone better in future in like future uh what I got a token there. I I I thought it would change in um later levels, but it, it's just Oh yeah, it's oh, just oh, oh, tower. <laughs> oh, tower. Where? Where? Uh, tower. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> Yes, yeah, like it, it, but it's like it's pretty much the same in in every area. It's pretty yeah. much just simplistic. Um, and then the, the, and then on Chaos Island, it leans way too much into two D. Yeah, it's it's I believe it or not, I'll this is the best we're gonna get, like in this area here. <laughs> oh, I gosh. remember. Oh, uh, my goodness. <laughs> Oh yeah, can we can we also segue into talking about some of the some of the guardians? Cause I I, I have some things to say about them. Yeah, I I'm I'm almost done with like these. It's just like uh oh whoops I didn't mean to press that um it's Ow. it's like I I don't find it unfun to watch something like zip zoom all over the place you know hit homing attack all the balloons and all that shit. It's just like it's. They, they, they really advertise, you know, he has more, like, gameplay depth this time, but it's, when you get down to this stuff, it's it's still just, like, the boost sludge you're used to. You know, it, it doesn't, it just feels like linear levels put over an open world. So it, it, it's, it's not much depth to it. Oh, I, I never got that one. Okay. Wow, it's because you didn't jump. You should have you should have put more effort into this. This is our second yeah, boss. Is... I will say I will say. Yeah. I will I will say th those parts. I didn't I honestly didn't really hate those parts though. I think one of my main complaint with some of them is that you'd be run you you'd just be running around and then you just do a platforming section you already did. Yeah. And then, because there are times where I just keep doing those over and over and over again because the game didn't really communicate if I already yeah. did that yeah. or without. Maybe me checking the map, which, why would I keep checking the map off, like, all the time when, when, you know, I, because that just wastes time, I guess. Yeah, the map has I a really long it. loading screen. I, I don't know what's up with that. Oh, really? Yeah, it's like... Oh, really? For you? Oh, For wait. You? Well, I'm on PC, I so it should be the fastest. Let me... 
Huh. Huh. like the the Pull map right looks decent. I the see see that see oh, how long okay, it takes no, for it to yet. show up. That like that's that's annoying if you try to do it over and over, which you're gonna need a lot yeah. to like know where you're going. I yeah. I guess I didn't use the map too 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 often, except when I was 100 percent in the game, but. But I just did. I didn't. I guess I didn't really mind that. Honestly, yeah, I wasn't really annoyed by it. Yeah, I never really noticed that too much. I guess, but no, yeah. Yeah, it, it, yeah. It, I'm not like okay. The first thing I noticed about the map is up. Uh, the, the loading times just are like that. Like, I mean, I could see you know doing that like super often. It'd be pretty fucking annoying, but. Yeah. Yeah, and also, and also in other games, like the map loading is very fast. Like a Breath of the Wild, the map loading is kind of instant. Yeah, it's, yeah, the loading's pretty good. Yeah. But yeah, it, I mean, and why not... aren't you? I'm, I'm, I'm waiting. Uh, but like back to what I was talking about, like with the little gameplay, little like rail segments, or whatever we're gonna call them. I, like, I, I, I find them fine enough. It, 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 like I, I can have fun with them. It's just like. That that's what they fill up the maps with. It, it's so frequent that I, I it kind of just gets annoying. Oh, I didn't do I didn't do the animation this time. Speak, speaking of the uh, speaking of the rails, I didn't mind the rails in 3D. Now in 2D, uh, I found this really fucking annoying, honestly. Uh, I I, I, I never awkward there. I'm not sure what you're talking about, but I guess we'll get there. Anyway, this guy... It's mostly on Chaos... Uh, it's mostly in Chaos Island and Rhea Island. Oh, okay. Island that I'm talking OMG, about. Nate, so OMG, I... they almost got my name on a Sonic Island. No oh. way. They, they should put my name in the game, honestly. I'd be honored. August Island. August Island. No, no way. way. No way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> anyway, I... This is, like... This is another, like, uh... Class kind of boss where there's multiple for... There's multiple different kinds, and they get harder and harder. And I actually think this is like one of the best ones in the game, at, at least for like mini bosses. It's like right off the bat, they like actually predict where you're going, so that's, that's pretty cool. So oh, you have wow, to yeah. take off layers yeah. by damaging yeah, I like it, or tower. Like, I like the tower. inside loop it. Simple. Like, it's simple, but it's effective, which unlike some of the other Titan bosses, I argue, where some of them are just more complex to the fault, to a fault, honestly. Like, it's, it really starts on the second island where you encounter those. Yeah, um, so you, you can damage them, you can side loop them, you can even try to, like, uh, f fight, you, you can use the landscape to find a way to go higher and, and like, land yeah. on him. Yeah, there's multiple ways yeah, of doing it, like. so, like, there, there's, oh, whoops, I, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> yeah, there's multiple Cheer. ways of doing it. <laughs> See, and then you tag ahead. Yeah. It, it, it's simple enough, it, it's just, like, you know, it's decent amount of difficulty, you have to... That you can find different angles of taking it down. It's, it, it's not brain dead. That that's, it's it's yeah. not. Yeah, it's better than a lot of the other bosses we're gonna see. Like, uh, I don't know if you're gonna get. I don't know how many of those you're gonna get to those, especially on the fifth island, because there's there's this particular one on the fifth island that I really do not like. Okay. Uh, can I can I talk about that one, the, the caterpillar? I, I, I've oh, had a feel. I had a yeah, feeling. Yeah, no, no, we, we had a feeling for that. it was the caterpillar. I hate that boss so much. Yeah, I. It might. It's it's, it's my least favorite boss. I, I'm just gonna be blunt. Uh, it's. It, I'm gonna be blunt. It's my least favorite one. I'll have to wait to see which which one's my least favorite. Anyway, uh, second cyberspace, and this is the hardest one in the game. For this no is reason. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so like, I... it's absolutely a mistake, but for some reason the S rank, uh. Time is very strict. Let me attempt it right now. Yeah, yeah. I this had was to actually act probably the most fun that I had. Yeah, yeah. Game. Like retrying it, trying to optimize it. I actually had a lot of fun yeah. doing that. It just sucks. I yeah. I never got to do it again because it was so easy. Well, that's a well, that's a time loss. Yeah, I, yeah, I already fucked you up. already failed. Yeah, I, I think I I already lost it. But. I actually had to look up like fucking speedrunning shit in order to in order to beat it. Like, what the fuck? That's actually kind of cool. Oh, okay, M maybe not that extreme, but like, yeah. If if I have to maybe, like, oh, yeah. If maybe if it's longer, then I would, you know, like I would. Uh, I that's I, I never mind. Forget what I said. Uh, but yeah, it's it's, <laughs> it's nice that I have to worry about optimizing. You know, I, I have to. Uh, 
Oh, I already lost yes rank. It's at 45 seconds. Oh, you guys are playing this level? Yes. Okay. Yeah, the, yeah. Old, uh, the only the good only one. Really di like, the only really that one that's actually difficult. So, I guess I guess I'm just bad at video games for hitting that one rooftop level run level. Oh, it's 55 seconds, not 45. 55, not 50. Okay. Uh, well, it's, it's deceptive how close I am, because there's really not much optimization I can do in that in that type of level. I think that's part of the problem. It's like, there's, there's not really shortcuts per se. It's just like up the up and down path, even though sometimes the bottom path is sometimes the best choice for speedrunning. So part, in the beginning part of special. Yeah. yeah. I don't want it to be all this difficult. It was kind of too difficult for this, but I, I, I definitely got something I didn't get out of any of the other ones when I had to, you know, focus on trial and error really trying to get it right and and it, it you know it felt satisfying when i finally got that s rank that yeah. that's what you miss out on when you get it like first try and i i wish i wish cyberspace was like that i i guess I might as well talk about the some of the puzzles so these question mark things uh if you do the puzzle near them then you unlock like um the the map around it, and once you do all of them, you can, uh, I, I think, fast travel, which I don't think is worth doing all of these in the island, but I, whatever. But you also get like like an, uh, a seed that lets you boost your defense or attack, so they're somewhat useful. Thing is, like, yeah, th this puzzle right here, all you have to do is hit these guys, and then you complete the puzzle. It doesn't get any complicated than that. Like the most complicated the puzzles get are like the, the the falling the falling block puzzle, which yeah, that I, I mean, can be a little complicated. That, those and took I, like two actually, two tries max. No, those ones yeah. with like the puzzle with like the turning lights. That was kind of oh, that, that that's not yeah. a that's not a question with mark puzzle. That, that's for oh. uh, to unlock the boss. Anything like anything oh. outside of the question mark puzzles? When it comes to those puzzles, they do require a little bit of thought, but. But actually, though, I think it's probably like probably the challenge, the challenge puzzle things that I like the most are the time ones. I think I don't know, I don't know. I just really like those ones. Th like thoughts on I know, thoughts on the crane game. <laughs> the crane game? What? What? Remember what? the sand area where you had to pick up the fucking balls to put them in the right color? Oh, oh, right. Remember that horseshit? Honestly, I <laughs> I remember. Oh, oh yeah, that's a good segue to talk about some of the mini games in the game, and uh, I have opinions on them. Uh, I I don't want to talk about them yet. Um, but like as for these puzzles, like I, I I understand easy puzzles, especially early on, but there's a point where it's not a puzzle. I'm just doing a thing, right? Like it's like what's I don't even what, oh I what, I love the what's the difficulty in this? I'm really? I'm just pressing shit. I, I love yeah. the wheel. You have to run inside. Oh my like, god! Like, like it ain't like it ain't like it increases in difficulty, but like you know you you know, but like when I say increases in difficulty, I mean it feels like like it feels like even even though you're on the fifth island, it feels like the difficulty only increased by like a level. Well, yeah, it, that's that's a lot of this game where like I guess it increases difficulty, but it's more a matter of now you're pressing two buttons instead of one. Oh, you're pressed. Oh, look at that! Watch out! There's a shorter time limit. Anyway, I, I will continue. I, I, Seal can we can catch them up. Oh, so we, oh, we got this enemy. Oh, the, oh. I think they're back. Oh, oh hi. So it, it's a pretty simple solution. Just side loop and yeah, yeah. It's it's like I I, I don't know how I feel about side loop as a combat thing because like it, it's. It, it's it's the like do the thing kind of mechanic where like the the everything will design itself around just like arbitrarily making you side loop. So so now like enemies will keep having shields, so you have to side loop them. Uh, there's um it it we didn't see it because it was already done, but there's a puzzle down a puzzle down there where you just had to side loop these fires to put them out, even though it could have been the same if you just like attacked them. You know, it, it's it's basically that arbitrary where, like, instead of hitting a switch, you have to now side loop it because they have to justify the side loop's existence. Yeah, it it, it just feels like a, 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 a not a step you don't need. 
you know, to, to, to yeah. justify existing. It is useful, though, Honestly, because of the ring thing, but not, yeah. like, anywhere else. It, it's just forced everywhere else. Although, yeah, I, guess, the, I guess, I guess, like, the block enemy, like, the like the enemies that form a block, you do have to silute those in order to get them out. Wait, that's the same thing, yeah. Thing, it's just, like, everyone has shield, so, so you can justify using and, the silute. And actually, using, on that topic, it's also a good time for me to talk about why I think the skill tree is kind of, is pretty flawed, considering that you can just get done with the skill tree easily, and then skill points are just basically useless. Yeah. So, what's the point in fighting... I, I guess... I guess it's the point in fighting enemies, because sometimes they give you portal gear, sometimes they give you, you know, C to power, C to defense, and all that. So, I, I guess there's a point in it a little bit, but still. I can't make a sauce for yeah, like, fuck. Uh... God. <laughs> um... Like, I... I had, like the skill tree done like early second island so like after that it was just getting so many skill points i, rem I remember by the time i beat the game i had like 300 almost no yeah like 300 skill points just sitting there not being able to do anything with them i think you might as well introduce oh, yeah, I, our I, I... skill tree though so silo yeah. we activate right away phantom rush basically your combo gets stronger the more you combo so it's like a snowball thing. We're going to see more of that in a second. What I want to highlight right now is Sonic Boom. The So this oh is boy. like the third thing, and it's the best move. So yeah. what you have here is... Crowd clear. Projectile. That does a lot, a, lot, a lot of damage. Activates instantly. Requires no contact. And... Yeah. And there's no cooldown. Yeah, no, no cooldown as long as you're in the air, you can use it. So, there- I thought there were- Like, the weird thing is, like, when I was playing the game, I thought there was, like, cooldown for some of the things, but no, it was just for the side- for the, uh, little mini side loop attack, and honestly, I- I thought that was kind of arbitrary, a little bit. Like, they oh, yeah, made, like, a charge weird, of thing, yeah. so, oh yeah, use a spin side loop thing, even though I- even though I think that could have worked as, like, a little small damage thing that like in between combos because I actually kind of like using it as that just a small in between on combos all right, all right so this I... is according to IGN a shadow of the colossus boss oh this is revolutionary yes so we we've seen plenty oh, oh and gosh. that's a good glimpse at the physics in this boss it has not been I... fixed since the IGN days still super I janky remember... I remember while I was playing it, I got stuck in the arm for like five seconds. Yeah. <laughs> so now you gotta beat the shit out of this now, thing. Now, if you. And now here's a glimpse at the power like... of. Oh. Now, if you don't feel like fighting the boss, you can just attack the legs and then you just get a portal gear that way. If yeah, one th the that's only like. Guard one of the one of the only guardian bosses that you can get portal gears in multiple ways, so. Oh. Uh, okay, so yeah, th this know. like. Is kind of one of the few ways that like uh, Psyloop is like neatly implemented, where you can like uh, if if you think of it, you can uh, side up the legs and you can get a little bonus out of it. But this is like the only boss where this happens. The, the rest of them are pretty basic. Yeah, but even then, some of them can get frustrating. Like uh... <laughs> the lure. All right, so now, now they have red things that push you back. Ooh. Holy fuck. Except, oh yeah, well, that part no, isn't red at all, so. And, and now Strangely there's these enough, fucking, I found uh, the... The, these red what? rings here. That was... Oh. Except it doesn't Honestly, really matter, the red, the red rings, rings kind of cause, uh... You could just jump over. Yeah, cause you're oh, gonna wait, be flying over wait. anyway. You're low on rings. You the might the need to the strange thing is, I found I still found those fucking rings annoying. Even though I've been jumping over them, I still get fucking hit by them for some reason. Yeah, sometimes like the jank just... gets you, but it, it's still like it's Honestly, basically. Since you're low on, since you're low on rings. You can show like how fast it is to get the full. No, I've already shown it. Oh yeah. Actually, cool thing about this oh, class yeah, is you... the only cool thing I find. Wait, let me. Uh... Oh, oh oh okay. I thought that was a grab move. It did. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Found a new move after all, all this time. So if, if you ever like fuck up the uh, this, this part, like, oh no, I'm flying. Oh, that's that's farther than I've ever gone. Okay. <laughs> We're reaching new frontier. Let, let's try that again. <laughs> to a new frontier. 
<laughs> We're reaching new heights with this game. Let's, let's try it again. Oh. oh. So if you fuck up, you can try to uh, climb with this. So that, that's like a single cool thing to this boss, and that's it. Yeah. <laughs> I guess it's fine as like a um, as as like the first real boss. It, it's just there, there's some jank that they never fix. Which really, I, um, but like that I, climbing mechanic with like all the rings and all that, that comes back in Giganto, but G it like Giganto's not buggy at all. It, like he, he works perfectly. There's no like weird jank to climbing him. So it, it's weird how the simpler guy has more jank to it. Yeah, I, I also will say that I, the, 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 that boss is better than, better than any of any of the Titan bosses. Actually, I guess I guess not any other Titan boss. Just any Titan bosses that decide to have phases. So the, the, here's part of the problem with Sonic Boom. It, it's it also auto locks. So you, you can just hello, and you're dead. This enemy, and then run to someone else. And okay, you require side loop. Oh so God, just evil. one extra oh, step, yeah. and then you're dead. Wait. Oh, yeah. What I mean? I'm, oh, I'm Oh yeah, I'm so happy they kept a part of the code where Sonic just runs and then all of a sudden you see an eagle. I'm glad they kept that in. Oh yeah, yeah, they kept that. Yeah, the eagle. <laughs> I, 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 I was like, I was happy to see that because I think that's just really funny that there's a part of the code saying, "Hey, if there's, hey, if Sonic runs in this direction for this amount of time, spawn an eagle." You need, you need to immerse him, okay? <laughs> he needs an eagle. It doesn't seem to be as common as the IGN footage. No, come back. Yeah, they did no. reduce it, but, but I just oh, no, there's you know, one. he died. Th these are these th these are Sonic's no. friends. Oh yeah, there's a squid back what? there. He died, and there's uh, no logo really in the air. Cool. What the hell? Uh, love, <laughs> love is in the air. Wrong. The squid. That's it's squid. Squid, squid uh, time. Yeah, I, I I don't know why, but I remember in the trailer breakdown stuff. I I really thought. I remember hearing about like race missions, and for whatever reason, I thought the seagulls were like markers for like where you're supposed to go. From there. <laughs> race a seagull. I have, I have like I thought it was like a diegetic like waypoint or something, but nope, they're just there. <laughs> anyway, I've already done this guy, but uh, this might be the best puzzles in in like the entire area. Where like uh, it's it's one of those like you have to run every tile at least once. And try to clear them all without these... like touching any tile <laughs> twice. And, like I, I say, it's on... the best, not because it's like you know cr creative or anything, but it's because like I actually have to think it out for a second, which is better than you know hitting some switches and then winning. There's one on Chaos Island that I was fucking stupid and I didn't know how to complete it, so like uh, the game got me there. Wait, I never the struggled on, on any because. Like, you know, they're so easy, but it, it made my brain work a little. That's that that's our bar right now. I, I'm, I'm just thinking about the one, like, one of them on Chaos Island. It gave you, like, two minutes, two full minutes of a timer to think it out. And, like, you can do it. And I, I did it in, like, 15 seconds. Anyway, um, uh, you, got, you can lock like, the air trick. Um... Which, which is, is the thing that kills me. Tree for some reason. Well, actually, to be clear, the flinging thing. Let me. Can I? Can I, can I do it right now? You, you never get it when you want it. it. It's always when you least want it. It's it, it's it's not consistent. Like the weird <laughs> physics you get with like you being flinged everywhere. That's still there. It's just you can't trick with it until you. Yeah. Until you you, you get you unlock the trick. Even though like, it, what what's the point of it without the tricks? Like that's clearly made for the trick. So I don't know. Yeah, I, don't, I I feel like they could have just handled the tricks in a different way so that it's not annoying like that. Like yeah, I, I will say. Kind of, yeah, I will say the tricks. I, the tricks. I I guess they kind of the, the part I'll say that they handled well is that it doesn't feel too disruptive. Like like I, I don't mean like you know physics department because y you know but like. I, I I I'm talking about like sound design or something like sound design and how quick the tricks are compared to previous games because like in previous games the tricks were you know much more slower 
which kind of worked for those games, except for in I guess generations a little bit, but in um, but but the the tricks in this game are just kind of fast, a little bit faster, Better. a little bit more quicker, because you're in a, because it's like in the moment, like it is like it's just in the moment when you're doing it. So, and I understand that they didn't they they just use a simpler sound for it even and not like a. Uh, I guess a more grander sound that uh yeah the sound seems wrong like one. like when we saw in the trailer it looks like a mistake like like the animation and the sound and everything yeah it I I wish there was like while it I kind of see what you're saying about it's not disruptive with the gameplay because it's meant to be like an average part of gameplay I, I kind of wish there was more follow through on the animations though because it feels like they happen like way too oh yeah fast, the animation but... oh yeah the animations the animations I will say yeah. Think like, I guess in general, the animations in this game need an improvement. <laughs> well, well I say really... that... I know that. Oh. Options? Come on, your option is only this. this yeah. This is what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Quote, unquote. Quote, unquote. There's like a really small gripe I have, I've had with the game. Like, the quick step doesn't, like, stack if you... Like um, if you're doing oh. it, if you're if you're pressing it multiple times, you have to wait until the animation finishes for it. The the quick step is honestly the quick step's only useful when you're like, you know, in the sections when you're doing a quick step. I will yeah. say there is some. It feels like this game combines a lot of aspects from like, fucking every single Sonic modern Sonic game. <laughs> it's the like like central Sonic game, August. It's, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's the pink. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah, peak I, Sonic. Yeah, so, like, what I'm talking about is that the game has... I, I don't want to compare it to Force... No, I, I, I'm... I've already well, done it. I Do sound, it. I sound... I, I sound... I sound mean like comparing it to Forces, so I'll just say this. The game, like, it does have, like, much simplistic moveset when it comes to, like, the Sonic boosting and all that. Similar to Forces. But it also has, like colors like sections where there's like quick step sections and you know the the the, the uh the fucking the drift god i don't know why it took me so long to say that well even to, though it's to be fair once in the game to be fair you know jump homing attack boost slide that's kind of like all you need in terms of platforming i don't think it needs to be much more complicated yeah yeah i i, I say like the the kind of I don't want to. I don't want to say forces move set because honestly, I just like to call it more simplistic move set rather than oh, Sonic Forces invented simplistic Sonic move set, guys. Oh my god. Actually, yeah, speaking of that, one thing I've got to mention in like the controls uh, section of the video, I guess, for pretending this is organized. Uh, I I was confused <laughs> for a long time because there's basically like no way to get extra height with, with Sonic's natural move set. Apparently. I, I kept seeing people like stomp and then jump to get extra height, well, and, yeah. and I was doing it. I, I just never got it for some reason. Apparently, you, you, you have hold, to hold down no, no, no. stomp. You have to hold yeah, down stomp. I think that, yeah, if you keep bounce. holding it, it'll do a funny thing. Wait, what? What? I never knew I don't about know that. When you, you you never use it, but like I mean, it exists. It's a, like an AOE. I think so. But that takes so long, why even? Why? Okay, anyway, what I was saying was, like, I... Y you'd think I would just have to jump out of it? Like, it it's so weird how it jumps for me, I, I would never guess that's how you do it. Like, I, I would never find out about this move. Otherwise. It was what I was told. Which I was. I... I, I found this accidentally. Yeah, it's. I just, I, I, I found, yeah, I found it accidentally as well because I was like, wait, was I, was I bouncing when I did that? And then I checked, and I was like, fuck, I was bouncing. Okay. Yeah. It's... I just like to do it sometimes for shits and giggles. That's mostly, that's honestly most of the moveset in this game. I just do it for shits and giggles. Yeah. <laughs> Which is why I use the drop dash more than I should because yeah, I, I just use it for shits <laughs> and giggles. I, 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 so rarely use this. It, it's so useless, but I, I guess it's funny. It yeah, is it is. I, I like using it on down slopes because honestly, I found it really funny. Yeah, yeah, it it works down slopes too. So we we, we got that mechanic at least. If only yeah. you carried your momentum into like a regular run. 
Uh, that that yeah. that's only allowed in classic Sonic. No momentum here ever. <laughs> I'm asking too much of a modern Sonic game. I'm sorry. Anyway, <laughs> let's talk about more about the skill tree. Wish, that's what it's called. <laughs> uh, I wish it was so much more than what it is. All right, so let let's let's address the elephant so in the room. I I, I, I guess I'd call it. So I I expressed this concern in the trailers, and it's what I worried. So, Wild Rush. Dodge, and then press X. Oh, fuck. L. <laughs> um... But they... Okay, I'll That's just not do... what I wanted to do. Why did you press triangle? I I'm using I'm using a PS4 controller, okay. <laughs> Alright, so that that that's like a super hit. Okay, let, let's try out... Stomp attack. Press... Stomp during combo. Oh, it's it's like a it's like a it's like a strong hit. Oh, here's another one. This is like a strong hit too. They're all strong. They're hits. all strong hits, and they cost nothing. And it's it's all of them are basically the same thing. Like uh, homing shot. It's just like it's it's basically like it's a, a cutscene for a super hit. This like it, yes, it is multiple it's hits. A, this one, big... but. It's in one cutscene, so it might as well be one big hit. Loop, loop kick, hit. same thing. Ah, uh, this is different, but... Yeah, so much of Sonic's new moves in this... Oh wait, Cyclone Kick, that's another one? <laughs> Grand Slam, that's, that's a bit different, but... That's one, two, three, four, five... Wait, I can't count. One, two, three, four, five... Six, yeah, that that's the, six does different the, moves. Does the cross slash count as a, as a big hit? I uh, it's a bit different, but that okay. six moves that basically do the same thing. So like, why would you use them? Why would you use any of them if you could just use the one strongest one? Because if they're all mechanically the same and it costs nothing, right? And I'm pretty sure the strongest one is this guy, the spin slash. Though I I guess to be fair that you would unlock that last. But I I don't know it's it's just well yeah once you unlock the next thing you never use the last thing because it's weaker why would you use why would you use the weaker one even though if if you have something that's mechanically the same but does more damage so but thing is every single one of these is outclassed because of Sonic Boom because all of these are melee attacks so you have to get close to the enemy and possibly like risk yourself getting hurt. Well, the Sonic Boom always lets you do it from a range, and you still get, like, a damage boost over, like, just normal attacking. So, I, it, it, I just... I've never used any of these attacks, like, ever, in, in the entire game, outside of auto combo. Because I, I never need them. And I, I, I basically struggle... I don't struggle at all, just using just Sonic Boom. I, I, don't, I don't even memorize how to do any of these. Like, I, I don't remember them. I think it is really funny that auto combo is just an unlockable option. Oh yeah, let's. Yeah, that's wi that's weird. <laughs> like, oh, wow! Look at all these really interest, totally interesting inputs for these really cool moves. Now, if you get enough skill points, you don't have to learn any of them. D did you see that token right there? That that <laughs> that that took a lot Engaging out of you, dude. Gameplay. It's like, it's it's the perfect move. Everything... Song Boom kills everything. Like, I I don't know how people compliment this combat system so much if this one move has outclassed absolutely everything. Anyway, for the other... There's the skill tree. I don't... What were they thinking for this? So basically... No, fun. If you're attacking normally, the kicks or whatever, it'll activate all of these moves for you. Just just by itself. It's not even an endgame thing. It's just, you can... Yeah, it's, it's pretty early. Halfway. And, and so some might say, oh, but you, you don't do as much damage if it's auto combo activated. But, like, sure, I guess it's not as efficient if you don't get... If you don't do all these manually. But like you still hyper buffed just pressing square over and over, you, you, you made it so possible to just mash and then you win. 
But it, it's 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 insane how far just auto combo goes. Let me turn it on. I guess I'll find a boss first. Oh, hello. Oh wait, you go and you go and you go. <laughs> like I know I have more attack than I would at this area, but it, it's still just instant. Just killing them with the sonic boom. Yeah, let's fight this guy. Squid, squid, squid. <laughs> Kill squid. Oh no. Okay, so <laughs> th this boss I is a this in the air. Oh, I, I guess I'm going here. Yep. Oh, all right, I'm going here. I yeah. Sure okay. Do the sun makes it impossible to see his bullets. That's fun. Oh yeah, we're gonna see that. So this boss is like a, I guess like a class of bosses where you go along its trail. I, I do like those. I think those are neat. Well, like, you're about to see a problem right now. Yeah. It's 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 a lot of this. I, like I I do like the concept of like a boss that uses like a level mechanic as part of it. I think that's interesting. Thing is, it takes yeah. me so fucking long to te catch up to it. Then I, then I have to go yeah. through this bullshit. Like, the thing I thought, is, like, when, I thought the, the thing is, was interesting. this is much more doable if you do the fucking side loop shit. Yeah, you yeah, just, you, you know, have to prepare ahead of time to jump on it. Yeah. Oops. Yeah, when, yeah, because when I first faced this boss, I was like, yeah, uh, no, I'm just gonna skip this and just do the ninja over and over okay. and over again. Here's the thing though, right? I just lost my ring, so, and I can't get it back. So my, my, my choices are, like, uh, keep going and try not to get hit to actually, like, you know, land a hit on the boss. Or jump off, get some rings, and then take another five hours just to, just to fight the boss. Because... Honestly, just... Because I have, Honestly, I have to wait for it to loop around thing. to come to me, and I have to chase it down forever. And like these parts are so annoying because like you're not even doing it. Yeah, you're even, it's 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 so dumb. It doesn't even give you anything to do with your silly little hands. Yeah, just... he only like occasionally shoots those like really simplistic bullets. Yeah, yeah, I'll get. Some, I'll fuck. Wait, let me let me get some rings. Oh. Oh, I, I, okay. Yeah, I, I have to jump off to get rings. Next phase. Oh. I have to get rings. I guess I might as I well the... go full. I guess you can do the infinite thing too. Yeah. Is that what it takes? Yeah, that's what it takes. That's what it takes, okay. Cool. See, that's, that's the thing about a lot of bosses in this game. I, I get like the more major ones where basically you do the thing it wants, then it'll let you attack it. Then you just beat the shit out of it, right? It's mm -hmm. like, uh... It basically just becomes like, do this mini game and then do as much damage as you can in this short window. Like, it, it's never yeah. really about, like, using the right moves to take, to do the specific... to kind of specific kind of, uh, boss or... you know, like, like, clearly dodge while it, while it attacks you to attack it. It's, it's just... do what I want, then kill me. Like, I was hoping, like, the bosses would be, like, kind of weak to one of the attacks and there'd be, like, something to hint to that. But... Yeah, yeah, at least something like that, yeah. Yeah, but no, you just, you can just auto-combo it or just kick it a bunch. Yeah. Just do what it wants and then kill. I hate these guys. Just wait until oh, yeah, these they guys... stop moving. Ooh. Oh, yeah, these guys are especially annoying in one of the, in one of the mini games. Oh, yeah, like, even getting to the sky is so annoying. It's hard to tell, like, where you're even supposed to jump on him, too. Like, like, okay, I caught up to you, what, what the hell do I do? Like, <laughs> like, which is unlike one of the later Titans. I forgot I left the game on Spanish. <laughs> it's on Spanish? <laughs> yeah, he's in Spanish. Uh, I can barely hear it through the stream. Alright, let, let's go here to catch him. And he's down there. <laughs> squid. Come oh, with me, eagle. eagles. Oh my god, two eagles. We will fight squid together. <laughs> Sonic eagle what? form. Like, like what, what, what the hell do I do? How do I get on there? What? <laughs> Sonic eagle form. <laughs> Ooh, I think it's good. Oh, oh, I don't think that's supposed to happen. That's so fun. That is so funny. I know, I love when it turns to look at you. 
Oh, 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 oh. oh, I was lucky enough to. Oh shit, shit! No, 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 uh, no, no, wait. no, 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 <laughs> no, no, no! Oh, oh, come on, you can do it, damn. Well, now I'm at the Ooh. complete end of it, so I'm. It's gonna take forever to get there. Can you jump like across the? Other no, other I'm pressing jump right now. No. Oh. no, I mean like before it puts you in the cutscene. I don't know. Maybe. I mean, when you think about it, this is most of this is just a cutscene. Like, are you serious? Like, nothing's even happening. It's not even attacking me. Okay, now it is. Are you boosting or not? But it, it's still so occasional. Yeah, and I, actually, at times, it doesn't really feel like you're going that fast, I'll argue. I love it when the sun makes them impossible to see. Yeah, the sun's not really out right now, but like, at that point earlier, if, if like the sun can shine on the uh, the platform, so you can't see the bolts coming to you, like I, I can't like, believe that's an actual could, oversight they made. They could have just made them like a different color, I guess. They could just made them not like... shiny. Or I guess they could be like maybe like black bullets or something. Yeah. Hey, we can talk about something else while this is going. Yeah, I, I, I do wish like coming back to the skill tree. I do wish there was more than just like attacks. Yeah, I, I was expecting like platformer stuff too. Yeah, like I, I I've played like Spider-Man PS4 and Miles Morales like at least like two times each, and like so that kind of approach to skill tree. Yeah, th like, that skill tree is cool in those games. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. It's like it's a mix of combat and like traversal and uh, yeah. <laughs> There's only one traversal thing in here. Yeah, and it's and well, it's quantum quote quantum quote well, the quote. air tricks. <laughs> I I mean I, that's not really traversal. It's just a thing you can do. It's not. I yeah, guess it's, it's non combat, it's... but yeah, non comp. Yeah, that's where where are my passive abilities? Where are my silly? I know. Well, um, half it is just like, super kicks. This? That's pretty much Sonic it. Sonic hates. <laughs> Sonic hates pacifist. Sonic is not a pacifist, <laughs> he just wants to kill. He just wants to use his fists. I think he's evil, he should kill them all. Um, <laughs> but yeah, like, I, there should... Whoa. There should have been... <laughs> there should have been, like, a... It feels like they didn't fully commit to having, like, a skill tree. It, it like, feels like... I, like, I feel like this game wanted to, like, try a bunch of new ideas, and... But they they were kind of just sticking, trying to stick to the old formula, just to not alienate a lot of people, which... Like, yeah, I mean, yeah like, it yeah. just kind of, like, it tells me that Sonic Team, like, is... Both more confident and less confident at the same time. <laughs> well, I mean, it is kind of hard to do that with, like, introducing completely new... Con well, not completely new, but, like pretty new ideas to your mechanics to your games but honestly like also wanting to keep it in like similar to what you've already established well if we're talking honestly, like like um platformer or like techniques or whatever there's so much mm -hmm. from Sonic's history to, to choose from like uh but we already have light speed dash but what if that was an unlockable what if the bounce was unlockable what if what about a uh, light speed attack you know yeah, what if, like, uh, I don't know, we had a bunch of upgrades from, like, SA2, I don't know, what like... Yeah, the, the, Sonic has so many moves you, you can choose from. Yeah. You didn't have to make up new stuff, even. Right, they made up so much new stuff for his attack, so... Surely they can do the same for platforming yeah, moves. Yeah, surely you could bring, yeah, like, traversal options back, and even maybe some new ones if you can think of any, but... They, they're... There's... There could... There's so much that you can do, but, like, they just didn't. Yeah, and I would have more of an incentive to open up my skill tree, because once I get yeah. Sonic Boom, I, I, I felt the, I didn't feel the need to unlock anything else, I guess, except for auto combo, but... Yeah, that's yeah, it. Like, it, it, it should give you a reason to keep coming back to the skill tree for, like, all of the game, not just, like, the first two islands. Yeah, I, I, I only, like... Well, I, I buy first two islands, you finish it, so... <laughs> Like, I, yeah, I, I, to, to be fair, yeah, that's me, but... No, no, I finished it the first two islands as well. Yeah. Like, I'm I, pretty well, sure like, most players will finish it by then. 
Yeah, that's that was like a main complaint that I saw from a lot of people that said, yeah, the skill tree existed, but like, nice camera. It wasn't much. Yeah. And yeah, and it honestly, it's like one of the parts that I feel like could have been improved upon, maybe in like a sequel or some shit, where you know you have a more complex skill tree that has more stuff than just. Hey, you see this cool combat move they can only use in combat? Spam it. And and then <laughs> forget about it when you get the next combat move. I mean, at the very least, it could have been interesting if you could use those for other things outside of combat. Like yeah, like maybe... the bounce like like yeah. like the bounce could both be used as a combat tool and a traversal tool. What if you could use Sonic Boom for like like switches that you can't reach or something. I don't know. What if you have to like spin a fan with a spinny move? Huh? Yeah, what if you have to use the cyclone that you unlock from... Oh wait, Dan, are you asking to make puzzles harder? Holy fuck. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> you can't, no, you wait. Can't. <laughs> no, remember in really Heroes? Forgot. Remember in Heroes like, with like a, a very similar tornado attack? Where you had to do oh, it on poles yeah. to climb up it? You could have done that! Yeah. No, we can't do that. Sorry. <laughs> that 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 would that would be too much for for the average consumer. For our Sorry. intended audience of young adult eight year olds. <laughs> True. But I, I I can't believe they said this game is for young adults. I have no idea like where this ca that came from. It's because it's because of um, uh. What, what would make it specifically targeted to young adults? I don't know. Well, you said he's going for seinen or whatever it's called over shonen in this game, as an example of like the tone and all that. I, I guess, but like I, I can't. I, 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 I get that with the story, like with the writing and all that. Yeah. But I, this gameplay does not reflect that. Why am I doing this again? Uh, it, it, it's. Uh, if I that, do want to touch. If I do want to touch on the writing at some points, like I think the only like the main complaint that I have with the writing is, is it can sometimes just be references to city. Like yes, I, I appreciate the Tangle reference. I I really like Tangle, but at time, but then you're just gonna be referencing Zavok a bunch of times. You're gonna be like, okay, that's a little bit too much. And well, then they mention like Mystic Dark Ruins. Oh, okay, I don't I don't really want to touch on the writing, but I I think that's funny enough to touch on like to make an exception for that. But while, uh, before you do that, let me show one of the puzzles. So this is, this is one yeah. of the timer ones. You boot oh, yeah. a little oh. timer oh, yeah. and... Uh, what do you do for this? Oh no, am I gonna have to defend these? Oh, oh, oh wait, oh, it's Okay, the, it's this is one, one of the worst ones, actually. But like, it, it's... It, I, I was about to like to defend the ones that you know you have to speed in order to you have to speed to like a platform in order to do in order yeah there are that. ones and where honestly, you those have are my to favorite run ones. to a, a specific platform like in the map and i think that's perfect for you know sonic gameplay yeah, yeah i mean i mean that's actually the moment where i kind of clicked to me saying okay maybe okay maybe i like this game because there's like the the flight like on chronos island there was like the one where you had to climb up the climb up that and honestly that was like I honestly felt kind of cool doing that. Honestly, what, the one maybe in it was just my eight the brain. Oh, yeah, the, yeah the like had to one, rush. Yeah. yeah, and honestly, maybe it was just my ape brain going wild. But I, I, I don't know. I like that well, one. They're all very easy, but like you, you can tell there's more synergy and stuff like that, where you have to like run to a platform or quickly run through a bunch of hoops. Like that's that, that's a lot yeah. better than going over tiles, you know. <laughs> and and actually made me realize. I kind of like the. I actually kind of like the wall running a little bit. I do think it's a little wonky at times, especially when platforming. But, but I think when you're, but what, when it's just in the moment and you're just climbing up something, I think it. I think it's done pretty well. Yeah, I. I we're gonna see more of the wall running in. Uh, what's it called? Um, the sand area. But yeah, Mary's the wall Island. running works pretty well. Anyway, while I run around and do shit, we can talk about some of the writing. So okay, let, let, okay. Me, let, me, like, let me start. So can you go over to the waterfall, please? No, it, it doesn't activate. I, this is a uh, a mostly completed save file. Okay. Wait, let me. I might as well try. Oh, there it is. Ah. 
Oh, there we go. Thanks, Spanish son. <laughs> um, so, I understand they want to communicate to us that they understand that, that like, this game's more aware of the canon and all the mythos and all that. And I can absolutely appreciate that. Like, you know, games like Sonic Forces like felt extremely deaf to just like every other game. Thing is, they incorporate like mentions of shit just for no reason. <laughs> like, uh, like, like there's there's random bits of dialogue where Sonic's like, "Oh man, Cream's gonna like it here," or "Omega's sure gonna like that gun," or our favorite. Uh, it's it's something about Zavok that made no sense. What can someone find he would it? Feel right at home. Yeah, yeah. I, I, he, I, he said Zavok would feel right at home here in this area. But like, and then oh, he's doing terrible. I, I hope or, well, th th that part I like. <laughs> that part I like because he, you know, he, he fucking hates him. But it's like, what? Why? Why would Zavok feel right at home here? Why? What's why? <laughs> The, it's the because thing about... it's it's because it's the fire world and Zavok's yeah. like Bowser. No, no, he or said it here. I, don't know. I swear to God, he said no. it here. No, there, no, no, there, no, there no, is no, like a there's like a flower area. I remember trying to look for the area, but I, I swear that there is a, like a flowery area in the oh the maybe island. Okay, okay, yeah, that's probably why I thought it was here. But so the thing yeah. about those. The thing about those references, it, it was kind of strange to see since I know Ian Flynn worked on the writing and stuff. And like, in the comic, like, he does references, like, really well. They, like, kind of tie in smoothly. But then in this, Shit. it's just, hey, this person exists. Yeah, it, it's super well, I mean, strange. I guess it is kind of hard to tie it in diegetically when the whole point of it is a reference. And, like, there's... Nothing to like, I will, yeah, I, no will say, to they, they I will it. say I will say I I I will say I'm kinda less harsh on it because I mean it's just idle dialogue. It's not like main yeah. cutscene dialogue or something, but I do think um, in the main cutscene dialogue they do kinda hand in on the references maybe a little uh, bit. It's Although, yeah, yeah it, it, it depends like, so like, like the arc like arc. Oh, like, oh wait, like yeah, arc yeah. Canon. Okay, so like most of the shit, like a uh, shadow, I would like shadow's help or uh, cream like it here, or I wonder how Jet's doing. Like, that's completely random dialogue that can like appear randomly, yeah. but it's it's I still find it pretty cringy that they make him do a lot. The the worst one is yeah. when he like mentions locations. So when he's in like a forest, he can say, "Wow, this place is so green and like bright, just like green forest." <laughs> And and uh, in the middle of the sand area, he's like, "This place reminds me of Sandopolis, like because it's a desert." Like what? Did... Sonic has never seen a desert, desert before. And there's another one where he's like, uh, "Oh, these balloons! I bet they came from Spagonia." <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a line. Yes. Yeah, it is that's a line. They do mention because <laughs> all, all and... balloons come Sonic from and... Spagonia. <laughs> Weird thing is, Sonic. Unleashed gets a lot of mentions in this game, and I, I, I guess that I guess people really like Sonic Unleashed. So I guess yeah, I, I, I don't. I'm happy for that because there's been some unleash unleash denial recently in in mainland games. Where am I going? Yeah, so I, 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 I guess men them mentioning that, and also the one line that I will excuse because I'm fucking biased and you will kill me for it. They mentioned Tangle. I'm sorry. My okay, 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 okay. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Right? So there are two mentions that like go beyond just like okay, you're you're just game, like game canon. Yeah. yeah. So Tangle, who is from IUW Comics, she's meant it's a she, right? Yeah, yeah she. Uh, she. Yeah, she, she. She's mentioned in one of those like lines, which is like, oh, is that is that you admitting it's canon? Like what? I, th that, that's like, I'm fine with I, I'm, I'm fine with IDW being canon since it it already makes sure it like fits with the current game canon. Yeah, yeah. You, you can slot in IDW. I think it's just strange to like, th like, this is how you canonize it. You you just mention a character. Yeah. And also, sticks got canonized. Yeah. So uh, yeah, th that's somehow. the other one. Amy mentioned sticks. Yeah, Which, like, um, the, like and, and that does scene. not slot in. W w how did... Like, what? <laughs> I, I it's, it's just, just like, I, ooh, like, I hope... I, I, I wonder if, if if Cream and Styx are free. Like, how does that make sense? First off, Styx would not like Cream. I, I don't believe that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but, like, I... 
I, I don't like find IDW sure it's just like do you, do you just want like everything to be together without I don't know it, it's like it's such a weird bombshell to throw on us does this mean there's like a game canon version of Sticks that we've never seen before? I may be wait, like, is there, you can explain wait. it cause I like well, I, I mean, cannot I guess, be canon it can't I I guess I guess they kind of made I guess they kind of transferred did transfer over Sticks from the boom cannon to the main cannon. Oh, there's a star no. flash again. Okay. <laughs> no. But yeah, like um, like you were saying, making IDW cannon and random idle dialogue, like yeah, that's the like a blood strange moon rises again. It. I mean, it yeah, again, in that with IDW, it makes sense because it generally follows game cannon anyways. But like. <laughs> Sticks. Yeah, this is like a, a a Sonic game that like pretends you know Sonic X is canon to the game. That that would that would, that would be weird, you know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> almost almost like a, yeah. I don't I don't know. But do you think something like that would be? Worth I I don't know. Having, like, I, I, a I don't know. Like, like doing something like that that would be like a know. bad omen for your game. Like yeah, it's like oh yeah. yeah. I don't like, think it's worth it to have a whole series on your channel. Anyway, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so like, uh, I, I do want to mention like another thing, and that I remember they tried, I think I remember when Boom was wrapping up, they were trying to pull sticks from that universe into the main Sonic canon, because I remember she got like, so yeah, because I remember she got Sonic channel art along with the main series characters, oh, right. and, and she was in Sonic Runners. So yeah, I, I think I'm, she was in runners. <laughs> like yeah, yeah, she was in runners. She was in runners. It, 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 yeah, it's very runners. clear. How did I not know that? They're done with yes. Boom. Like they, they, like the show's been canceled. No more games. Like they're, they're absolutely done with Boom. But I, I guess like they want to take that guess, one character with them. Yeah, at Sticks. I guess Sticks was popular enough to the point where they were like, okay, let's just bring Sticks with us. I I, I mean, I guess I don't know I if I believe I, I guess. that, but yeah, whatever. <laughs> I, I remember Sticks being at least kind of popular, but, but I yeah. I wonder if they're gonna I, redesign her at all, like if they do incorporate her into Game Cam. I think they're probably gonna Cam. keep her the same because she was the same in like Runners and the Sonic Channel art and all that. So well, I, think I mean, she's relatively Sonic Runners the same. Then, kind of. I mean, I, I guess really it's a cross. I guess it's like, I guess yeah. it's a crossover sort of shit. So like, I mean, they got me. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not like Sonic Runners is like the ultimate canon. <laughs> oh, well, isn't that the game that said uh, the whips? That means that explained the whips. That means whips, whips. that means uh that just means that Eggman canonically worked with Satan from Puyo Puyo. So uh, <laughs> I don't see what's wrong with that. And 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 you can get the original Sonic One Genesis cartridge as a floating pet that gives you yeah and uh stuff. and that. Uh, and also, canonically, the Death Egg's a pet, which actually isn't yeah, that bad. Egg, yeah. That's a really cute and, idea. <laughs> death Egg's a what? And, it's like, uh, it, it, uh, there was like a, essentially like a like a bonus, comp. It was like a it was essentially a pet system where like you could have like up to three, thingies with you that gave you different like stat boosts or like abilities, and they were based off of like, different things like Death Egg. Like, the, like, for the- there was a classic Sonic or birthday event or something that had, like, uh, the S Sonic 1 Genesis cart- no, it was the Sonic 1 cartridge and a fucking Genesis just floating behind you that you could unlock. <laughs> um, th there was a bunch of other stuff that I do not remember- oh, I think- wasn't a Razor Gen one or, some, or something? Oh my god, okay. I don't remember. Not even this yeah, game was, will go in that deep. There, there were a bunch of just, like, Sludge from like Sonic, different Sonic games that you could have as like pets. Uh, Black Knight, Secret Rings. Can, I, can you get um, like a like like a, a Doom's Eye? <laughs> I think so. Maybe. Also, Mephiles. Oh, also, Mephiles was in the game. So, uh... <laughs> yeah, yeah Mephiles was an unlockable character like later in 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 its lifespan. Yeah, and like randomly, I and like I remember when I was watching like a video on Sonic Runners. They made a theory about like since Mesley's is gonna be in Sonic Forces, there was gonna be. What? They, they kind of... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, right, because that was like you before. You never, you never, never heard about Mesley's was gonna be in Sonic Forces, and then they, 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 they scrapped him. You don't know the Sonic Wars leak script. I you don't do know not all that. believe that. <laughs> I can, I can send it. I, I, well, I, can, how, I, I don't think. I, would it be like not verifiably right now? Real? Not right now, because we're talking. 
not, not, not. Okay, I won't, I won't talk about it right now because it's doing Sonic Frontiers, but I'll, I'll send it later. Anyway, oh, let's, yeah. let's look at this oh, puzzle. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh uh, yeah, oh yeah, this is a Sonic game and not Sonic Runners. Actually, wait, Sonic Runners is a Sonic game. No, it isn't. Dude, no, it isn't. Dude I love Sonic Runners though. Anyway, Anyways. this is uh... <laughs> okay, the, you know what, there should have been a puzzle, like, in this, where... Where it's just very fast, you have to you have to do lightning speed reactions. Yeah, what if it was like extremely fast and you had to like yeah, well, like have that really good not... reflexes? That that would make actually like something. <laughs> what if you were like dodging stuff that was falling? Well, instead? you probably need more panels still, but yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, so like I this puzzle I saw earlier that's even dumber. That I have to show that. Okay, here here it is, here it is. So Oh my gosh, this one. What I you do this. is, you hold forward, <laughs> and there's an actual time limit to hold forward. No way. Super challenging. Like, God. are you serious? <laughs> Again, like, there, there's an easy puzzle, and then there's not a puzzle. Like, what? <laughs> like, is, is whole- uh, I- Oh, up there, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Guess Lord of the Rings. Okay, at least I will not, say, I, 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 yeah, I, I will say, I, I, I get that they were trying to add in text for like flavor and Sonic just asking about the world, but honestly, it can be really disruptive when he just stops in his tracks. Yeah, I don't know why they have to dialogue. stop you to do it. You can't just say it while there he's moving. There is an option for that. There is an option for that. Oh, that's weird. Why would oh, anyone well, yeah, but, turn but that it on? Is, uh, it is on by default, though. Yeah. Oh, weird. Well, I, I guess that negates my criticism, I guess, but still, well, weird. I, I think it's strange to have that as an option at all. Why would anyone want to stop yeah. playing just for him to say that? So you can stare at the camera angle <laughs> it gives you for longer? Oh well, man, I can look at what he's looking at, like, even better. No way. Well, I mean, even then, like, with the option off, it still turns the camera towards it. It just lets you Fuck. move. And then, if you move far enough away, it'll move it back to where you are, so. Yeah. I... Goodness, I'm, I'm I, good as I've been too harsh. I should probably think. I should probably say like a positive or something. I don't know. Well, this, I'm gonna do cyberspace. I will say, so I have fun with that. Cyberspace is, is a thing. Uh, I already said cyberspace is a thing. Um, I was, yeah. I I don't know. I just I guess I just find this game mindless fun, honestly. I I find, yeah. I I can agree to that. Just you know, running around doing shit. Yeah. It's... Yeah, honestly, this was the most fun I had with a Sonic game in, like, a while, honestly. Because, honestly, with, like, most of the Sonic games, they don't like to be fun. They like to torture me. <laughs> well, I, 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 I hear what you mean, but, like, you can easily pick up, like, Generations or Mania and get, you know, pretty good yeah, experience. Yeah, I know. I, I know. Yeah. I, I know. I know. I know that. Also, I'm not gonna try to compare this game to Mania, because, God forbid, no. <laughs> no, I, Mania is a totally different beast from this game, God. So, hey, this level reminds me of Sonic Mania. Oh my, this, god, oh my god, that game has Green Hill too. So does Sonic this, Forces this, and Sonic Generations and Sonic Lost and, World and, uh, and, and Sonic, Sonic 4. Two, Sonic, Sonic and 2 Sonic for 2. Game Gear. Sonic 2 for Game Gear. <laughs> and Sonic Adventure and Sonic Adventure 2 for that one. Bonus okay, see level. what I'm talking about? Like it, like it, it brings me to to the rings. Like I, I can't not get it. Also, I, I guess some of this. I, I actually really like some of the 2D cyberspace levels that's like a speed run sort of thing because mm -hmm. I honestly. I, I don't know. Uh, I guess. I Honestly, when I saw like most of the 2D cyberspace levels, they seem more plat for me to me than, you know, just. than just, I guess, other 3D Sonic games where it felt kind of stiff to control him. Like. Here in 2D, it's, it feels weird to control him still, but I felt like he was a lot more optimal when to, moving in 2D to 3D in the cyberspace level in this game, which is weird. Thing is, um, it gets a lot, it gets away a lot more with relatively simple platforming and like boost segments because you have to take it from like a, a speed running fr perspective now to get the keys. Yeah. So and because of that, yeah. it, it's it's not like as bad as like a forces level. 
Yeah, I honestly, honestly, if I were to choose, I, I see this argument a lot. If I were to choose uh, cyberspace levels or 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 uh, forces levels, I'm taking the cyberspace levels any day oh, of the fucking week. But that's yeah. not saying much. That's forces is levels. Um, they make me cry. Yeah, like so. I feel like forces has conditioned me a little bit <laughs> for like. <laughs> Because <laughs> like we're like I was used to it being like super automated. <laughs> well, like so like I, I kind of I I, hey, I don't think I had too much of an issue, but sometimes I just kind of expected hey. it to be automated, but then it wasn't, and so then like I fell. But <laughs> hey Ray, when are we doing that race with Sonic Frontiers? Oh uh, no, dude! I I oh <laughs> uh, that's gonna be. So I don't... I don't know. <laughs> it took me like... 20... Like, it took me so long to just beat it because I wanted to get 100% map completion. I... Just... I... You just... No, just... 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 just speed run it with big. <laughs> just speed run it just with speed big. speed run it with big, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what we do. Just speed... Just big percent. Okay, there's like, a there's example more routes to take. what I was talking about with, uh, Silub, it's just like... If you don't know how to interact with the thing, just Siloop it. it. It'll do the thing. Siloop you know, it does the you know, thing. I, did, I actually do find, like, really funny... find it really funny that there's probably, like, three completion percents for this game, probably. There's... Actually... Wait, are there any I can't, categories? Hold on. Not, not, there's, I don't Good think job. there is yet, but I'm be I bet there's, like, fucking big percent and cyberspace percent <laughs> or just anything percent. <laughs> big percent just sounds really funny to me. I, I want to see a big percent. And I guess you never explained, like, the progression in the game. So those little pink hearts you get, those are memory tokens. They're different for every area because they change depending on, like, the character you're trying to save. Uh, so you want to get uh, memory tokens to unlock cutscenes. Which progress the plot. Uh, like, right here. I, I get to talk to Sa- Okay, this is, um... These are meant for Amy, but... You also have to talk to Sage to progress the plot, so... You get this weird animation. <laughs> Actually, the funny thing is about these is that once I beat the game, I never got any of the Sage ones, so when I went went back to get those and Sage fucking hated me still... <laughs> it just felt really weird because I think... The end of the uh, game is like completely fine with you. Yeah, and then, that's pretty funny. And then, and and then you just go back to there, and then Sage is like, "I'm not fucking talking to you, yeah. God, oh my God." Yeah, it's weird. I so, will say, I, I I will say, I did kind of like Sage as a character, even though I did have like a few issues for her. One nitpick I have is that I don't like that she's like an Eggman AI. I kind of wanted her to be his own thing, but it, fine. It's like a minor nitpick at the end of the day, but. I hey. did find it kind of inconsistent about... If I want to remember what I found inconsistent, I think it was... How... Like, 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 how she's... Like, how she says, Please, get the fuck out of my island, and all of a sudden you go into cutscenes and, and, and she's, like, completely fine with you being there. I I agree, it's just... just I, I said we, we, <laughs> we probably shouldn't talk about writing that much for at least this video. I am a, I am a, I, I, I analyze Sonic shit, so I, I'm, I, I, I apologize no, it, for it's being okay. a Sonic fan. Anyway, I, sorry, I just, like, I just I'm looked sorry up, I like this. I just looked up Sonic Frontiers on speedrun.com. There are some categories, but it's, 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 it's kind of expected. It's just any percent. Uh, there's like doing all of the arcade mode, all of the cyberspace levels. And oh, really? uh, and 100%. I will say, it's really, looking it's at really Steve... funny. There's only one guy that's done the 100% category so far, <laughs> and it is like six hours. Oh wow! So that's so that's that's something. Anyway, as uh, I was thinking about the progression, so fuck. Uh, you, you collect the tokens to get cutscenes to progress the thing, but also you need mm -hmm. to fight the bosses to get the gears. Which, uh, or, or I guess, like, find easter eggs, which I, I did a second ago. Get the gears to unlock cyberspace. Do the challenges in cyberspace to get the keys. And the keys unlock the Chaos Emeralds. And obviously you have to get all the Chaos Emeralds to finish the island. So you have to, you have to, you have to get the tokens for the cutscenes and the Emeralds for the final boss. Or, like, the area boss. So you have to do those. And I, 
Some people think that's like too many collectibles just to progress, but like, I, I don't know, that... I feel like that justifies, you know, like, exploring all over the place if you have a bunch of yeah. different collectibles. So I'm, I'm, that, and then, I'm cool with it working like that. And then you got Big, who's just... <laughs> oh, and Big. You know what? Let's, let's go to Big. Do you, do you Big, have it on the map? Yeah, he's, he's Big's down there. Super, okay. Big's too nice. So, there, there's a small problem with that little progression system. Actually, first off, with side looping, you can get you can get memory tokens like just doing this. So you, you don't yeah, even. Yeah, need I, it's a lot more tedious. To it's a lot more. T it it's a lot more tedious, I'd argue, but it, it's there. Okay, well, think of it like this. I was in the last area, and I just really wanted to get the game over with, and I I it was so annoying to tell the difference between a segment I did explore and a segment I didn't explore to find tokens. So when I was like ten hearts away from like finishing the last few, I I, I just caved in and side looped. It, it was so much easier for me. So, I just I just use big. Yeah, I yeah. You, big. I didn't think of big at the time, but big kind of breaks this game. So yeah, little purple portals. Like I I guess he infected it. But <laughs> the big infection. Oh, corrupt. Oh big. yeah. Oh yeah. That's another annoying thing. When you're in comp. When the enemy sees you and you're in combat, you can't go anywhere. Yeah, you, you can't even annoying. open the map. We're trying to open the map right now. I, I can't. It's it's so annoying because yeah. I count as being in combat like this far away. And this is really annoying when you get to the fortress. When you get to the fortress, that, he just appears and you can't use the map until he's like far, far away. And, and, and you know, it's on Chaos Island, so... So, I, I guess, on paper, there's, like, a fun little sign thing. But, I, uh... So, yeah, we, we get to meet Big. Hey, Sonic. Welcome back. So, you have to collect those little try? purple coins. I'll let you borrow around. So, we, we were wrong. They're not Mario Odyssey coins. They're big coins. Unfortunate. No, no. What I mean? Very fortunate. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you, uh... Yeah, you, you fish. You go where you want. Yeah, and then what later it catches you. You, you. you do a quick little. Oh, oh I forgot to. Sorry. Wow. <laughs> you press you're a, so you, you bad at fishing. Sonic this video guy. becomes Super Saiyan. This guy. And you get a fish. <laughs> yeah. And now it's one token, but trust, but like on later islands, you get a fuck oh ton of tokens. Yeah, you're. Th this is not like. It, it, it's pretty exploitable with the amount of tokens you can get. Let's see if we can get a big one. And there we go! Oh, Marlin. Yeah, six tokens. Like, and it gets even more insane in later areas. You're, you're getting like. And a, you can get like 48 tokens. Yeah, for one you're thing, getting like. Eventually. On average, like 10 per catch in later areas. Yeah. And what can you get for it? Portal gears, memory tokens, keys, seeds. XP, like, okay, you yeah. can just get everything. And yeah, so, it's not even that early, expensive you, either. Yeah, if you find it early, you don't have to, you barely have to do any progression. Like, I remember, yeah. I, uh, tokens are five coins, which isn't really worth it, but keys are 15, co 15 tokens. Keys are 15, and portal gears are like eight. Wait, th that's, that's insane. That's so cheap. Yeah, 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 and... Honestly, I used big for like the last few sections just to get seeds of power, new seeds of defense, and just all the cocos because that's kind of what I needed them for. Yeah. And then for the last island, I just grinded out the memory tokens just on big. Yeah. Because it's you know, it, it, it's so it's so fast, like it's way faster than normal progression. Yeah, I didn't I didn't have too much of a problem with it, but like I but like I'm just gonna acknowledge. It's fucking broken. <laughs> yeah, it's broken. I'm gonna buy Coco it's... so I go faster. <laughs> yeah, uh, I, I only really experienced it on the last island because I found it earlier than I did on the other ones. And yeah. Like, with, it's... with like, one session, I went from level 50-something to max level on speed, and I unlocked, like, all of the emeralds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can just... It's really funny that you can just kind of skip some of the emeralds and all that. Interesting. And honestly, yeah. I guess it just makes I guess it also makes speedruns of this game really funny because you can just 
the, 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 there needs to be a big percent. There needs to be I a hope, big well, percent. Yeah, that kind I of fucks like, like the meta because now it's very RNG dependent. <laughs> I, I I hope that's the strat for any percent though. <laughs> you just well fish. then again, yeah, just big fishing mini game instead of it torturing people. Even you know, it didn't torture me, but uh, but but that's besides the point. It, it big went from torturing people to uh being a good person okay so the inter the only interesting thing here oh, i guess it, like the game breaking shit is interesting but the uh I, like like the new item here is egg memos yeah ash accidentally called them egg memes so I, i'm gonna call them egg memes so <laughs> um they're basically little like uh lore entries you, you can get from th that's like eggman talking about stuff and there's like me 20 of them I think. yes there's like 20 of them and honestly it's the best written part of the game like it like there are references in this too but like it, they're actually justified that they're brought up i'd say like he mentions he fucking mentions the black arms in in, in them like th the, that's how <laughs> yeah and the and the babylonians yeah babylonians uh this is actually the first time eggman talks about maria which is insane. Oh, right, yeah. It, it, it's, yeah actually, it's actually like cool. well written. You know, it, if the entire game was like the egg memes, then I, I would I would love. I, I I would love the writing a lot more. Unfortunately, egg unfortunately, they're just egg memes. Yeah, they they they, they are egg dreams. God, egg memes. Top text oh, yeah. bottom. Top text bottom text. <laughs> Honestly, mad. when I when I when I when I first saw the egg memos, like or, or memes, memes or whatever egg the memes. fuck, yeah, yeah, it's memes. <laughs> like like I I I, I uh, when I first saw those, I can't help but think of fucking Bendy in the Ink Machine for some oh, fucking no. reason. I, I, I think you are ill. The voice logs. I I, no, I, I think okay. you are diseased. Oh my gosh, guys! Oh my gosh, guys! Eggman <laughs> mentions Sammy Lawrence from Bendy and the Ink Machine. <laughs> Oh yeah, I can get these tickets, fraud. these car cards from, uh... Look, it, 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 guys, it, it came out a week before it Dark came out Revival. A week before Dark Revival. It, it, if, it, it, if you're wondering well, like, what, what these cards do, it's just, uh, lets you buy stuff. Gives you, yeah, honestly, you know, honestly, it gold cards can be kind of annoying to get when you already got all the important shit and it's just grinding out, like, just... Well, I guess it's good if you're to... grinding, like, something expensive. Yeah. Cause it's it's I always guess, one but, ticket for everything. Yeah, but like uh, when you're grinding for the one ticket things, like I was doing for my 100 thing, it can be pretty annoying to get those, honestly. But yeah, uh, oh, I, again, I I don't want to talk about the writing too much, but I, I guess it's like gameplay relevant this time. The, the um the relationship between Sage and Eggman. Feels really rushed without reading the egg memos, Ooh. egg memes. Sorry. Yeah. But yeah, because like you know we get to talk about how like he slowly likes her more and like their you know growing relationship. But these are so easily missable and like out of the way that someone could really easily miss them and basically get nothing out of like their characters. Yeah, they go from like like if you don't know about the egg memes. <laughs> If you don't know about the egg memes at all, it pretty much goes from like, oh well, this is this is my AI that I made to kill you to good luck to I your gave daughter birth in to like her. two hours. <laughs> yeah. Like two hours time, it just happens. And there's like because you don't really get to see that other than like the very limited cutscenes and the egg memes. You get you, bar you barely get anything, any content. And the egg memes. Otherwise, <laughs> I'm trying to say them with a straight face. But by the way, that's the uh, that's a parry. You, you just hold it down and you're invincible. Th that's Until like something hits you. That's not how a parry works in like any game ever. <laughs> like a parry, a parry is supposed to be like a like a a secondary defense mega like a uh, move. Where like if if skilled players really want to get like an extra advantage, they can they can try to time a parry to get you know like, to like stun the enemy or something and then get a counterattack. This but no, here it just acts as a block. Yeah, yeah, because in, in this game, the same time. 
basically your only other other defensive move is the dodge, but it's like barely useful. So basically, you your, your primary um, your your primary defensive move is parry. So they have to make it generous to like actually be usable. Except the par the parry is super good, so it's just overpowered. But like, so now it's just like most supersonic bosses become piss easy if you know about the uh, the parry. Speaking of that, I, I think Maybe. it's about time we, we show uh, we we show that. All right, all right. So uh, the game doesn't actually let you rematch bosses, so I had I had to get a mod going. So since I already have a mod client going, I might as well do this. So let, let me let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Uh, live reaction. <laughs> Shout out. Right, right. You you did talk about the. Yeah, this game has some pretty good mods. So. Send me this mod okay. right now. <laughs> anyway, this is just a mod that, that lets me select bosses, so I can show them. Do you have the Giganto Gangnam Style mod? No, that that's for another time. No. No. Alright, so... Oh, hey, Tyler. Hello, Tyler. We're about to show I, off I, the Giganto I, boss fight. I saw gonna... Shadow the Hedgehog, so I joined. No, I'm just showing off that dumb mod. Fuck Unfortunate. you, I'm Oh yeah, uh, funny thing here, I was gonna... this cutscene is really squashed vertically. Yeah, I don't know how wh why. How did that mistake happen? I think I... they forgot to put the aspect ratio to this, so they, in, they like... I think they for, yeah, I think they forgot to have the cinematic aspect ratio for the cutscene. Yeah, they, so they, they squashed it, so they it by it. just squashing it, that, yeah. How would, the, how would that mistake it through? I don't know. Anyway, uh, so yeah, yeah I, as I said before, uh, you collect Chaos Emeralds for every island, not just the entire game. You know what that means? That means, uh, there's a Super Sonic fight for every single area, which I think is pretty cool. See, so, yeah, this is our first boss, and it's, it's similar to, as I said before, it's similar to, um, that, that other climbing boss, except it's way less janky. What is it? Like, yeah, what is it? A, oh, Asura? Yeah, Asura, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. I, I'm climbing oh, pretty seamlessly. Oh. Even the rings are getting no problems here. And, like, even when I'm climbing around, it's, like, kind of pretty complex geometry. I'm, I'm, I'm all good. Maybe because it's in a more controlled environment? That's the only reason I can think of? I have no idea. But, and you're dead. No, I'm fine. You see, you yeah, you see you're able to get up more... Okay, th th that that was weird. You see, but... Sonic is completely fine. You're getting, you're getting all up in that armpit. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a two fan. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, you click that emerald and. All right, so okay, I I I understand. It's very cool what happens with the music and and the big punch punchy punchy. But, well, I'll show it. So. You know, I, I, this cutscene's, I, I, I can't do it just, just as with, with, by, uh, cutting the cutscene. I do find the Super Sonic animation kind of weird in there, though. On to the other side. <laughs> okay. Super Sonic! <laughs> but I'm only pressing square right now. Oh, I'm breaking that auto combo on. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And parry, okay. and counterattack, and... <laughs> I'm to the mind of another side! <laughs> so this is the part where I'm gonna have to speak my words of why I like this fight, no, I, I, or I, these I, fights. I think I'm showing right now what's, uh... What, where, what's the problem here, so, like... I, I, I'm doing so little here, right? Like, yeah, he has little lasers here. Except the lasers are behind him, so they never actually hit you. So like, I, what's? And, I, and only f in future fights, I, I remember it did that those lasers kind of did matter, but it's only in later fights, yeah. not this fight over here. 
So yeah, it, it's it, it's just the, yeah. So like, there's, there's a QT oh, wow. here as well. It's pretty simple. What, what my point here ultimately is just like it it's a pretty mindless fight. Like yeah, the music's cool and all that, and like you know it's like the Super Sonic Wow. It, it's really cool fight. It's but like, mechanically it, it's so shallow. I I can't. I just don't get anything out of it. And like. The music didn't like land for me right away, so I didn't get the same feeling a bunch of people other got, which made them think this like the the best fight, like ever. And, and I, I, I just I, I didn't get the cool feeling out of it. So so all I had left was the gameplay, and the gameplay was just so simple. So that that that's what I think about it. So you can share now, I guess. I, I don't know, but I, I, honestly, I honestly think these fights are fucking cool. I'm sorry, fuck. I, I'm yeah, sorry. I, I completely understand. I'm sorry. I, I completely understand. I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a fuck. I know. I know. I know. I, I, I like. I know. Like you can, all, you can only like parry in these fights and whatnot. I understand that, but I just think these fights are just really fucking cool. I, I completely honestly. Understand. Yeah, I don't know, and I don't know. I just really like these fights. It's it just like, if it doesn't if it doesn't land for someone, it's just it's just nothing yeah, to I, it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I I understand why you feel like that, though. I'm not gonna. Yeah. You know, how dare I mean I'm absolutely no no no. I mean, how dare you not feel anything? You're supposed to feel yeah, something. Your feelings are supposed to be exactly like mine. Yeah. Yeah. Me exactly. Yeah, or else. Yeah. So yeah, I I understand honestly, but. I, I, I really like these fights, and it's why I think the last fight is very disappointing. Oh, I'll get yeah, to the next I forgot one. about that. We, we will get yeah. there. I, that, yeah, that, yeah, if you want me to see complain, if you want me to see me to complain about the, some of the bosses, uh, there you go. <laughs> there you go, you'll see me there. So, so what I think cool about the, what I think is cool about the Super Sonic fights is that, like, it's still the same gameplay style that, that you w would, like, learn to control. But now yeah. just like buff, buffed up, so so like oh the boss still performs as like a, a test of um uh. I, I I'm going to assume that's the mods fucking with me right now, but sorry I <laughs> see, the the it, it's still a test of like what you know in the game because Super Sonic it's it's still the same gameplay style which a lot of other Super Sonic fight, yeah. fights can't say the same you know like sometimes it's like just, it's an entirely different game sometimes. With Super Sonic yeah, fights. Plus, plus, I like how Super Sonic's more prevalent in this game than, uh, yeah, than yeah, in it's, previous titles, where it, he's not, just a final not, boss machine. It's not so detached from the main game like every other Super Sonic thing. Yeah, like like Sonic Forces. Remember, yeah, yeah, re yeah, Sonic Forces. Just you had He wasn't even part of the main game. Yeah, you had to you just get him for free, no, 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 and that's no. it. What, well, because Sonic Forces, like, it, you still have the same moveset, it's just you had, like, you know, you're super-powered. What I'm saying is stuff like, yeah. um, Adventure, Adventure 2... Oh, yeah. Like, um... Uh, okay. 06, I guess? Um, Sh I don't, don't remember how much Shadow was, like, the core gameplay, but... Like, stuff like that, where the gameplay basically changes at the end... So you don't really get to like use the uh, the the stuff you've mastered, like all all your moves and all that. It, it's you just have to use this new thing for the final boss, which is usually a bad thing. But in this, they make yeah. sure that Super Sonic is like very similar to how he plays normally. Yeah, like at the very with that, least, with that, like I'm gonna say no, no. With that, I'm... this game's final boss still breaks that rule. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I mean, uh, technically, technically, they no. introduced do, it. Do not, do, 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 do not defend not, the end in front of me. I'm not defending it. I'm not defending it. <laughs> Look, I can't even defend that. I can't even defend it. Is the so I'm sorry. It's so I, silly. I, I, I wish I could. I wish I could get to it right now. I wish I could, but. Okay, yeah, so like Wait. speaking of that, uh, we're probably gonna divide this into two because uh, this this recording we're, we talked about the core gameplay in the first area, and for next time we'll talk about the, the last four areas. 
And so, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll talk about, like, the progression and all that. So, yeah. j j just I'll... know, for now, uh, <laughs> the final boss is the worst part of this game. It, it's act I, I, I'm confident enough to say that that is the worst Sonic final boss ever. I, uh, you know what, I could probably, I could, that, it's probably on my list because of how fucking disappointing it is, especially towards, like, just, you know, how I felt about the bosses, you know, in this game overall, and how I think they're really cool and all that. So, like, you just get the final boss, and yeah, I'll just get to it there. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. yeah. Like, like, Gigando and all that ha absolutely has a cool factor. I, I can't even say that about, about the end. Yeah, I, I, so. I cannot wait to talk about the end. Oh my god, I, 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 I can't wait to rip oh, a new asshole. Oh yeah, it's moon uh, ass. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, uh, uh, I, we didn't really get to talk about the mini games, but I guess I'll get into those more when we get into like the other islands, because god, I also hate those. Oh yeah, I didn't even get to talk about, talk about the traumatic experience me and Trashy had, but that, oh. that'll be for another time. That'll be yeah, for the, next time, I guess. When, when he, you, he's you actually here. He, yeah, he, he the traumatic built. experience. Bitch. I, 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 I had a traumatic experience with those mini games, so I'll share mine as well when we get to it. Yeah, I think my brain just fried after the first one. No, it was every single one of them, mm. except for maybe one. Did you like Sonic dancing? <laughs> he's he's so hot. <laughs> he he twerked right in front of my face. I loved it. God damn. God damn it! Is it bad that I like that? I, I, no, I'm no, gonna get no, fucking no, 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 for no, saying no, no, that. No, 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 no. We just found it super jarring. <laughs> we just, we just thought it was funny. It's perfectly fine if you, if you, if you don't mind it. If you, yeah, if you like yeah. It. I don't know. He just, it's just silly. I like his silly little dance. Yeah. I'm, I'm like half expecting for like Hero Brian to appear in this box here or something. Is it a creepy pasta or something? <laughs> No, I mean, yeah, Sonic.exe would appear through it. Oh, okay, thank God. Thank God Jared isn't in here, because I can't endure another Sonic.exe talk. I would kill myself. Well, well, maybe if you want to try killing yourself, maybe you should, you should try, you should try, you should try, you should, you should, you should maybe you should try starving yourself. All right, we're done. Goodbye.